are two hometown teams at this year's Scott Tournament of Hearts, Saskatchewan champions from the Cali Club in Regina, Kathy Trowell will try to win another national title, but she'll have to beat her sister to do it. Canadian world champions, now Olympic gold medal winners, Sandra Schmerler and her team from the Cali in Regina with Joan McCusker at second. And yeah, her sister, Kathy Trowell. Three teams are tied for first place with two and zero records. Alberta, Team Canada, and Saskatchewan. Then they bunch it one and one. On through a huge group that sits at one and two. And one team remains winless. Kelly Kalo from Yellowknife, the Yukon Northwest Territories. Boy, oh boy, it's sister against sister, club against club, province within a province here in Regina in the Scott Tournament of Hearts. On any given Sunday night here at the Cali Curling Club in Regina, 12 sheets are in play for a mixed league, but not this Sunday night because this is Cali night at the Scott Turnout of Hearts. Hi everyone and welcome back to Regina, TSN's continuing coverage of this 98 Scott Turnout of Hearts. You see, of the 12 games that are usually scheduled on a Sunday night, six of those games have cancelled. Those people want to be and will be at the Agrodome to watch Cali against Cali because it's Cali clubmates. Sandra Schmerler, Team Canada against Kathy Trowell, the reigning Saskatchewan champion. And they're both two and zero. First place is on the line. And the added note, the story, is that Kathy Trowell just happens to be the sister of Team Canada second Joan McCusker. What a great, great story. With more, Linda and Ray. Well, Vic, it's the third draw of the day, and we're expecting it to be just amazing tonight, Ray. Two Saskatchewan teams in Regina. Well, this is electrifying. We've been in a lot of places lately where, you know, it's electrifying, but this is unbelievable. You've got the two teams from Regina playing each other. You've got sisters playing each other. And the interesting thing in our country is that we have a million two curlers, and this kind of thing can happen. You have one team, and rightly so, is out of all the accolades and won the gold medal, world champion, and another team that they think in their own mind they're just as good as that other team, and they're on the ice together. So this should be a tremendous night. You've got 7,200 mm -hmm. people here. It's just going to be hopping, jumping, and rocking. And if you think Team Canada has an advantage, well, they were the heavy favorites coming into it. But I think I get the feeling that Saskatchewan team is drawing the inspiration, the excitement from Team Canada. When they went to the Olympics and won the gold medal, well, Saskatchewan felt it. All of Canada felt it, actually. But this Saskatchewan rink just seems to be drawing something from them. And if they can draw from the crowd tonight, if they can take the excitement of this building and take it and play well, because, yes, they've played great. Two wins so far and two really decisive wins, then we could have a terrific Battle of Saskatchewan tonight. Vic? Linda, they have sold standing room for this game in the fifth draw. Saskatchewan against Team Canada as the sisters. Trowell and McCusker hook up, and they're both looking forward to it. Here at the Scott, I'm really happy for her to, ex to have this experience, to be treated like a queen like we are here in this week at the Scott Tournament of Hearts. So I'm happy that she's got this experience. Uh, the fact that I have to play her along the line, my feeling is the earlier the better before things get too complicated. I think it's gonna be really exciting. We're looking forward to the game. Both of us going in with 2-0, it's a win-win situation. But only one team can win on the ice. And the team that loses will suffer their first loss here at the Scott Tournament of Hearts. And just a reminder, you can keep up to date on all the scores, player profiles, and of course, we'll be at the Labatt Briar. We'll be able to do the same as well. The complete story on our season of champions is available at our website address, www.tsn.ca slash curling. The only seat available is the one you've got. What a night. It's round five of the Scott Tournament of Hearts on TSN. I've been through good times and bad times in the market. You know, the decisions and the advice I provide for my clients' RSPs are designed to protect their money. That's how I make my contribution. Canadian Imperial Bank of Commerce, seeing beyond. She says she forgives you, but next time, 
She's calling Allied. Okay? Okay? Thank you, Canada, for making Allied the biggest and best in the country. The Nabob Coffee Company has harnessed the power of the volcano. You see, the nutrients in this volcanic ash enrich the nearby coffee fields and help grow the better beans for Nabob tradition. I'm here to select only those better beans that meet our high standards and give Nabob tradition coffee its better flavor and aroma. Mmm. At Nabob, we get better beans. You get better coffee. Linda eats the same thing every weekday morning. Day after day, week after week. Toast is toast. Now Linda's eating Eggo waffles on weekdays. They're as quick as toast and a delicious change from the everyday. Kellogg's Eggo waffles. Lego, your same old breakfast. Clean, clean is my business. So when I'm on the road, Super 8's my motel. Clean carpets, clean seats, clean. Clean inside and out. Life's great at Super 8. When AT&T Canada started this dime time thing, I said to myself, dime boy, you got to be a part of this. Call anyone in Canada any evening, any weekend for a dime or less. Who needs the phone? Dime time someone you love, OK? I'm no hero. I'm just trying to get Canada talking. One dime at a time. New dime time, only from AT&T Canada. Thursday, the NHL's best are back on TSN. Catch an original six matchup between the Leafs and the Rangers. And best of all, there's no time change. Molson NHL tonight. Check it out on TSN. The 1998 Scott Tournament of Hearts from Regina, Saskatchewan on TSN is brought to you by Pillowy Soft Purex Bathroom Tissue. Welcome back to the Agridome. The four sheets in play, our featured game, Saskatchewan Team Canada is on the extreme right, that's sheet D. Boy, it's warm in here. I'm sure it's presented some problems for Lloyd Stanzel and Dave Berklinger, the ice makers, right? But it doesn't get any better than this thick, and it includes the ice. They've done a wonderful job all day today. The ice has been great. We'll talk about the curl. It's about two and a half around the center guards on both sides. Around the corner guards, not a lot of play, but about three. Finishing not badly. The key to this ice is that when you step the weight up, for example, if you got the hit on this from the outside in particular, it'll run very straight. Big weight shots will be important this game. Same on both sides. Coming off the center, a little bit of curl, but not too much. There should be tonight a little bit of frost build up out here because it's so warm with 7,200 people. The slide path has held all week. We expect it to hold again. This should be a sensational game. I haven't felt it like this for a long time. Well, we wondered how much she would have left if she would be physically, emotionally, mentally drained after Nagano. But she's on top of the table. It's Marcy Gooderwright and Carrie Lynn Schakowsky who throw the lead stones. Joan McCusker and Karen Daku are the seconds. Jan Betger at third for Team Canada. Christy Lewis for Saskatchewan. And the two skips for the defending Canadian and world champions, gold medal winners from the Cali Club in Regina, Sandra Schmerler, and for the Saskatchewan champions, Kathy Trowell, also from the Cali here in Regina. Team Canada play red stones. They will have the hammer. Saskatchewan to play yellow. And to get us going, the Saskatchewan lead is Harry Lynn Schakowsky. Well, Lou, they've played each other many times, I'm sure. And, and as I said in the opening comments, the interesting thing is that we have so many teams in this country that are just on their fridge. And, and I know that psychologically and mentally you feel to yourself, gee, okay. we're just as good as them. We've played them, we've beaten them, we've been there. But this is the best women's team ever put together, and their record shows that. So this would be an interesting game. Now, it starts with the head curling, and it'll be interesting to see how Kathy decides to play against Sandra. You know, we, we believe that the best way to play Sandra is to try and get her out of her rhythm and that would be to close the ends early. But uh, the first rock thrown into the ring, so whoa, whoa, this would be an up whoa. and down, I would think. 
One of the things for Saskatchewan, one of yeah, the issues yeah. uh, why they might be playing that stone in is this is their first game of the day. Three. Team Canada coming Four. off the afternoon draw. Saskatchewan yeah, playing yeah, twice three. yesterday, but not yet today. Four. And there may be a few jitters after sitting the couple of draws and knowing the building is full and knowing who they're playing. Well, and, the, and the thing too, Vic, that's interesting tonight is that the crowd is kind of caught in the middle because obviously uh, Sander and the team have just won the gold medal. It's, it's, you know, it's the team of their heart. Yet you take a team uh, representing their province and and, and uh, a team that they say yes. that you know so that how they will cheer will be really interesting you know well it's funny because there are four games on the ice but for 90 percent of the people here there's only one game and it's all focused on sheet D. exactly but I, I I've been job, we've been in we not I we've been in so many buildings and seen so many great things happening in this game over the last sweet, five or six guys. years but this is really electrifying tonight I mean obviously because you're, you're here in Regina the two Regina teams the world champion the gold medalist and uh, you know your representative so it really is something special and they're standing yeah. they're standing room only mm -hmm. right around I saw there. you outside trying to scalp that ticket I, I was <laughs> really I was embarrassed you know I yeah. thought there he is you, know. you mean through the glasses that's and the mustache yeah that's, that's right me. and that little trench coat <laughs> with the hat yeah, <laughs> that yeah, little Swiss yeah, hat yeah, yeah. <laughs> corner guard by Sandra we saw the terrific numbers that Marcy put center, up last year at the Scott Tournament of Hearts. This year, two games, 86%. So she's right on track. I was asking them before the game, okay. the travel team, if in fact, you know, they were a little bit in awe of this. And they said no, because our, like now, the Manitoba Playdowns, you went into an arena. They've been doing arena playdowns no, no. here in Saskatchewan for a long time. So, and they set up the draw yes, exactly yes, the same yes. way in preparation for whatever yes, team won. Yes. I, I do think, and that's, that's a good right comment on your part. The only thing is they have never played under this particular situation when I mean a full building uh, the uh, the television Actually, no, the, you know the, the microphones so uh, whether or not that that will have any effect on their on their performance or not I, it will be interesting I mean the thing that you that amazes me and I said in my opening comments yesterday Linda is that this uh, Schmerler team you know it's very difficult to play as number one all the time you know when you're when you're on the top which Looks they've good. been now for three or four years you know every game you go on on that time you go on the ice you're number one Shot and it's going. really hard to defend that that's added pressure but they just continually show they went to, to Brandon stuff. they won there they went you know they came yeah. to the heart first just and won there again, again. and then they went to Brandon and won there and now you go to uh, Kawaza and play in the in the Olympics Wainston. and you win there unbelievable team for being able to get it all together Karen Daku as we play the second stones in this first and right Team up. Canada does have the hammer. Right I think something right that up. every team right can up. learn from from that example right Ray is that Team Canada is very able to focus on the shot. They don't let the big picture sometimes you can take oh this I'm in the Scott Tournament of Hearts I'm playing in front of all this crowd. They definitely have gotten to the point where they play one shot at a time. They think through that shot the sweepers are into every shot. They're very intense very focused and it just shows up in their play. The results are there. Well, I know if you've been with us across the country and you're with us tonight, uh, you also have to be looking very forward to this Other match. Other side of the line, if you can get it there. Yep. Santa has a huge following in our country. Yep. Other side of the line. Kathy's relatively Three. new. You know, we know her in the West, Good but Jones. she's not known across the country. So it is, it's really, uh, and she's just, she's got a plan. You can see that she's not going to get uh, involved in anything uh, very fancy yep. too early. Team Canada with last rock in this in the sand and Sanders thrown up three corner guards and yep. we've had three peels. Three. Saskatchewan right third right is Christy up. Lewis. Right up hard. Right guys, hurry. And both right up. Christy and Jan, right the two hard. thirds tonight, right come up. in with 80% right right shooting Good percentages. Job. That it's is good. the top amongst the thirds. So it could be quite a battle at that position. Just go a little tighter here. Tight. We've said it a hundred times, but it, I think it's worth saying that Pretty this team lives, think, yeah. leaves nothing undone, Linda. You know, you and I have talked about it uh, in the hours that we spend together privately, even in, in off the air. It's just that they just seem to be able to, uh, uh, you know, cover it all. Uh, and when they get in that rhythm that I that we talk about, we refer to, they become so difficult Let to beat tight. because you, you, if you can, you have to try and get them out of that. Tight as it'll go. Yep. I mean, that's easy said, isn't it? I mean, yep. <laughs> so. Tight as it'll go. Good, Jan. Shot. Take a look at the other games on the ice in this fifth draw. It's British Columbia against Quebec. Both are one and one.
Prince Edward Island, New Brunswick, both one and one. And Alberta, Kathy Borst, one of those undefeated teams at two and zero. Kelly Kayla looking for her first win. She's zero and two. And the teams with this Sunday night off in Regina, Ontario, Nova Scotia, Newfoundland, and Manitoba. All of them at one and two. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Close, yes. Whoa, no, 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 no. Another peel. Right over. Right over, right over. And it's all premeditated. Right it's the plan. She's That's not going to get involved in any offense, right and she'll probably wait until she has last That's rock. Okay. One of the uh, the things that I showed, I, I mentioned, or I put down on the uh, on the reading the ice segment is that the, the reading of ice will be so crucial. And that we saw today on a couple of the sheets where no the critters had uh, you know had some trouble with the reading of the ice and the calling of the ice. And it's it's a great surface, a little bit tricky. The frost, if it does come in a little bit, will make it even that much more difficult to read. Or just tight. But, uh, One of the two. Again, the Sandra Schmurder has yeah, a great bite, talent in yeah. being able to understand yeah, the ice yeah, surface really, really. and just a bite, just a bite, just a adjust bite. to the changes it okay, makes throughout the game. Fine, this way. Think about there, hey? Maybe yeah, open good. a little bit because I'm just going to throw control. Okay. Okay. One thing we'll be interested in tonight is to see if any of the frost creeps in from the right. As you see, we're next mm -hmm. to the stands in sheet D, and we hadn't seen rolling, much sir. difference from sheet to That's sheet great. so far, but tonight with the building so we full, we will have a look. <laughs> we we do have some portable oh, yeah. dehumidifiers yeah, that have been but brought in on both sides we'll of the building, yeah. and they're trying to draw some of the moisture out, so uh, see if also that makes a difference. You, yeah, I'm just going to give you control. When did you have time to do that little research? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I... They're right beside our sheet, so when I looked <laughs> over, uh, there they were. That's why I love you. Control. You will prepare oh. some uh, oh, no, right statistics on. and numbers for me for the morning show, will you please? <laughs> <laughs> Tonight, absolutely. <laughs> and we're seeing a lot of uh, hits from uh, Kathy's team. Okay. Ooh, that one ran out. very straight. When, when you play the Wait first up. end, you're hoping to have a chance for a draw, and uh, unfortunately for Kathy, she threw that little extra weight in. Ray did mention in the breaking the ice segment that it was very straight. So hits nine and a half seconds, and they will run that straight. The key one is the draw, 14 seconds between the hot lines. We think that's what we saw earlier today, and it stayed very consistent throughout the game, assuming the frost doesn't creep in. Split is there, but it's tough. Tap back's the best. You know, just well, she back. put it there, and she asked for it. You, you know, think? we try to get it. She tried to get it there, but she Three said and it's and okay stop. short. And you saw the flash. Now it gives Sandra the chance to come down, just tap that like rock practice? into that area, and yeah. sit yeah. right in front of it, and set up potentially two points. The exact thing that Kathy Trell did not to want to have right. happen, right. Okay. and that's oh, why she peeled on. all those corner guards. Advantage, Team Canada with the hammer. It's now a two-on-one shot. Sandra Schmurder playing a tap back. And so with this one, we'll see it a What's little away, bit faster than draw. One, so then. 13 to 13 and a half for a yeah. tap. Do you agree the split is the tougher shot? Yeah, it is. They're, they're so far over. She can accomplish what she wants just by tapping it back. The weight was perfect. Just curl a little too much on I didn't her. Split it, did I? No, oh, you didn't. Yeah, I know. I needed to be on it. Rats. Far over there, so you can probably see about half of it. You're having a look at how much of the rock is visible from the hack okay. end. Okay, that's right. You threw that well. Yeah, I think I threw it well. Yeah. I I think we just had too much ice. Yeah. That's a good comment from Kathy because she has a lovely delivery and we don't often see her miss uh, no. open hit. So, so well, that's kind of why that I, I tried to point fine. that out in no. the reading the ice. As you mentioned, Linda, is, is that there's no question incredible. we've seen it all day and yesterday too that when you do step it up, they no, really run straight, almost yeah, to a point where they, uh, I think they straighten up on you. Hers. I think maybe I must have too, Denny. Or I was over, I don't know. Yeah, I, had less ice I think with your weight, you'll be fine. You'll be great. Yeah, let's get it. <clears throat> Kathy Trowell, who won a Canadian Mixed Curling Championship in 1996. Her final stone here in this first. Just control. Clean. Whoa. Just Clean. control. No. no. Just right control. Up. Right up. Get through. 
No roll. It's good. And the shooter will hang around back 12. Yeah. It just straightens out, comes up. It's good. That weight? That was less weight than my first yeah. one, so weight. That, that was, was a less. good throw, Linda. Yeah. And the weight was the key. If yeah, she'd overthrown just, that at all, just, she would have um, never seen any part of that stone. No, that's good definitely delivery. something you have to be very aware of. It's nice ice. It gives you a lot yeah, now. We've seen it uh, got the split. Yeah. during the day. We've it seen it possible for come yeah. arounds and that sort of no, thing, which maybe yesterday we didn't yeah. see. But you just have to be so careful with the weight. It really hats off, as I mentioned uh, earlier, to uh, Art Stanzel and, and Dave Merklinger, because the ice surface is tremendous, and these are tough working conditions. And their entire crew, by the way, not just those two. Uh, it really is. It, it's, it's great. It was a little tough yesterday, but they had the opening ceremonies and stuff and people standing around and yep. lots of warmth, so. Other Final way. stone looking for the blank. Team Canada here in the first. Roll it, Mars, roll yeah. it. Yeah, Doesn't have to roll that hurry, far. Hurry, 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 That's good. And that's enough to do the job. Team Canada blanks the first end of play. Sandra Schmerler holds on to the hammer. Here in Regina. What makes Ford trucks so tough? How about the choice of two available powerful Ford Triton V8 engines? What makes Ford trucks tough to beat? How about the world's only standard third door on the Ford F-150 Super Cab? And what makes Ford F-Series the number one selling truck in Canada for 29 years running? Hard-working Canadians who need tough, versatile trucks for work and for play. Built Ford Tough. Nokia Discovery. Small words are hard to read, which is why at Nokia we make our screens big, so they're easier to read. Inspired technology with a human touch. Nokia. Connecting people. Honey, do you need any help? Mommy, I'm a big girl now. You can feel the cotton Softness. Cotton is soft. Cotton <laughs> Gentle. Hypoallergenic. What's going on in there? Just bathroom stuff, Mom. Cotton Feel the cotton is softness. <laughs> Welcome back to Regina. It's the fifth draw of this 98 Scott Tournament of Hearts as we update you on the scores of other teams. Sue Garvey with the hammer scores one against Marie Claude yeah. Carlos. PEI holds on to the hammer, blanks the first against New Brunswick, as does Alberta. Kathy Borst from Edmonton against Kelly Kahlo from Yellowknife. And the blank in our featured game on sheet D, so Team Canada. Sandra Schmirler holds on to the hammer against Kathy Trowell. Of Saskatchewan. You gotta like this right and just now. an apology to hey. Lloyd Stanzo. I called him art. I don't know where I got that from I because that I know Lloyd very well. But well, ice making being, is an art. It is, an and art. he does That's a wonderful good. job. And he has, they are doing a great job. I apologize to. I'm nice, helping. Nice try, bailing him. <laughs> yeah, you know. we're partners. You know. <laughs> <laughs> if you go where down in flames, do you think he's there with the extinguisher? Absolutely, he's there with the gas. He's throwing it on. Just here. 
Got two long guards in that free guard zone whoa, that's good. That's good. area. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's good. It's interesting, Marcy uh, Goodright, the lead for Team Canada, mm -hmm. tried to come around and was very short, curled early and yeah. sort of tapped up the other Yellowstone. And there's another one that's short, so we will really watch this sheet. Well, this is a great early opportunity here in the second for Team Canada. Marcy Goodright, interesting, we were at the Cali to open the show. And her father-in-law is the manager Lots of, of the Cali Club. We're back, back house. Line's nice. Through the forefoot, Joan. Yep, yep. No. Yep, yep, yep. Right back. Right back, right back, right back. As far as it'll go. Free hard. Free hard, free hard. She got by those uh, at center line guard by quite a bit. She did that. Yeah. Let's go. Here's 23, five. Okay. Okay. Top of the forefoot. Come around in turn. about where this rock can be positioned. The team without the hammer doesn't mind the freeze. The other team prefers them to be in front of the tee line. You can bump it a little bit, Joan. Just back, uh, back eight, wait. Joe McCusker. Shot, Joan. Nice That's shot. moving very well because she easily had that line weight and it came up nicely. Just a freeze yeah, by the foot. face of it. Just, just a tiny bit. <laughs> Karen Daku. Line's good. Yes, Brian. Nice high delivery. Good whoa, soft swing. Whoa, lots of room. Back. And very clean lots release. Of room. Want to leave it. Those are always Honestly, great combinations. What do we got? You're up to Back it. To it. So got to corner freeze it here. Right, right to, to it. it. No, it's right to it. Right to it. Right. Whoa, it's whoa, 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 whoa. No, no bump. No bump. That didn't break as well. She it has a little less rotation on the handle, and that could have a bearing on it. Joan and her sister, back Kathy. Well, yeah. you had about back line, so just a couple feet less, not much. Okay. Try and get this on the nose. Okay. They played together the year prior to Joan joining Sandra. And they met, they, Kathy was saying she thinks they really, their first big game was yes. in the 92 Provincials when they knocked heads there. And they've been, yeah. don't forget, yeah. When you're trying to get out of Saskatchewan, you're trying to beat this team. And that has been tough for a lot of teams uh, in Saskatchewan. A lot of teams in the world. Well, she got a lot more movement. Now, I don't know if she uh, was inside or not, but boy, that rock really, that acted the same as her first one did. You know? That's right. Caught it early, and Marcia's first uh, come around attempt did the same thing. So maybe a little bit tricky right there. Edge of the forefoot might run a little straighter. Forefoot area curls a lot. Christy Lewis, third stone here in this second. No score, Canada. Schmerler with the hammer. Wow, Carrie Lynn Chikowski 
gives you almost a foot by foot <laughs> analysis That's of weight. That's terrific. Yeah, you're right, Vic, and I think it's great That's because they knew exactly it was over curling and a bit heavier, and so you need that information to go for the plan B. That's exactly what you do when you're sleeping, isn't it, Vic? Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not the right information. No. But it's it's there. Yeah, and it's Where? A, it's information. It's there. I always hate when, when you say, Vic, I think it's top 12. <laughs> that I think is what killed you. Jan Betker. Oh, my. It's absolutely taken off. Moved him around, and it's shot stone. Good shot. Appears to belong to Team Canada. Second and third shot yeah. are Saskatchewan. You know, Christy, I don't mind this. Are we one? No. Team Canada rock is shot oh, rock, but you can see what Kathy's well, thinking. Know, that if you move things around, first of all, it's not no, easy I, to get rid of the red one. I, li I, li I like. Uh, then they're going to get two. The problem, we can't hit it. We're just going over here. Absolutely. Okay. I wouldn't be taking a run. I don't mind that, Kath. Yeah, and if we, if we bump this and sit here, she's just got a double. This is okay. okay. See, they got set. Right on top of it. Just peeking into the game between Prince Edward Island and New Brunswick as they play the second. PEI with the hammer after a blank in the first. Tammy Lowther, Charlottetown, Kathy Floyd, St. John. The hit for one, two, three, and four for Prince Edward Island in the first. This is a very key shot, and, and Kathy Terrell is absolutely correct. You've got to draw to it. You can't be hitting it. It's really moving, though. It is. It's way back, Kat. Okay. That's all right. <laughs> that just took right off. Know, it's a I very interesting it. situation. Sandra has called Jan down. Both teams worried about where they. I hesitate to do anything here. Yeah. If they move things around, I what'll happen? To do anything here. Like if you hit this on the nose, it's going there. But this one is in the way now. Yeah. I think we just. But why don't we just, we could just play here, just play guard. Then we can play a tap for two. My last one. Tap on what though? Huh? You don't like making a play on that one? Well, what do we, how do we play it? If I hit it, if we hit it on this side and we roll here, we leave a double. We'd have to hit it on the nose and that's gonna go there, but then we leave a hit and roll. You could play it with quiet weight, just tap think, it to here. Just, just coming off the nose, we want to roll them both this way, don't we? Or no? You mean to hit it on the nose and hit your shooter and do that? We can try that. Yeah, okay. Unless you want to play a guard, but I don't know. Well, this stuff's behind the T-line, so it shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. Okay, let's hit it. Uh... The only thing is we don't want to lose it. Well, we're not going to lose it. It's going over there. If you hit it on the nose, it's going over there. We can play it with quieter weight, if you want. Well, it cuts so much, though. Whatever you want to play, it doesn't matter. If you want to play the guard, too, I, I don't care. No, that's not bad. Let's play that. With just the same weight you just had. On the nose. Hit this rock we can roll here on the nose, yeah. which will jam on this one had. here. That'll go. It's normal. OK, and the yeah. shooter will just sit over here. Is he it just past the nose. Just I past mean, the nose. That's not going to leave a pocket, Linda, you think? No, no, I think this is a good shot. I wouldn't guard no, at I this position with Last Rock. I wouldn't guard. The question of the weight is a good one. How much weight do you want to play? And they ironed that one out. Well, if you guard, she'll yeah. guard that. And then, you know, it, Sanderson will have the tack back, yeah. but you won't have it. Yeah. She'll put, she'll put the guard It'll be a 15-foot one if you have it. Yeah, It'll be a long right. one. Yeah, that's right. And double. Yeah, this is a good one. Get over. That's a nice shot. One, two, she lies. Shoot. Yeah. Well, yeah, but yeah. it just, uh... Nice shot, Jan. Well, I'll just need to cut a little more. Just move a little more, yeah. and we get them both over there, didn't, yeah. Didn't move nearly as much as my first one. No. She wanted to, it, it to curl a little more, so she could have got, you know, this stone over here, too. This would have been here and over here, but 
It didn't happen, so now the hit and roll it becomes imperative to hit this one here and try and roll into this area here. They catch the, like if they get to center, they'll run, but, but uh, control weight, it should run pretty straight down. Good. You can do this. <coughs> Kathy Trouble. Close, yeah. And the first yep. skip stone here in whoa, two. Whoa. Wait, great. Whoa. Whoa. No, no. 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 Be ready, little Karen. Bit, bit. Go, 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 Karen. Go, go, no. It's a very sensitive Just spot. Center, sure is. That's what Kathy was talking about. She's saying, I think yeah, when it gets to center, it'll like, make a move. Over. Just, like I like what I see in this young lady, though. Boy, I tell you, we have never had a chance to watch her before. And she is. She is mechanically very, very solid. Yeah, both her and Christy, actually the whole team have very nice deliveries. That weight was that weight was really good. Yeah, we should have been sweeping that. I don't know if we would have still. Oh, well, maybe. Yeah. Think. Well, think you need more? Well, I got to the nose with that. With. Maybe let's throw this. I'd have to hit it pretty bad to jam it on ours, so. Bumper. Yeah, I like Bumper weight. Hit get this here. Chance to lie two, chance to lie two well, covered. Well, didn't really, it just kind of sat there, yeah. so. Weight's okay. the same down here? Yeah. Here's a good look at it. Behind the sheet. No. Sandra Schmerler. She put that out. out. Yep. Oh, I think you're oh, trying to oh, roll it. Oh, oh, they oh, have no. to watch the jam. And that's what they've done. Okay. It's okay. She got a little bit of a break on it. Too wide. She is shot rock. She's second shot rock, I should say. Just wide. Hmm? Wide. Yeah. Well, as Linda mentioned, I think just in the release, she got this outside that of it. Right there. Option. Just got it outside. You can see it slide away from the center line a little bit. Get out that one. And the center line we mentioned is very critical. It just hangs a little bit longer, and she had that pretty well full she hit weight. Sick. So the Yellowstone back eight foot too? stays as shot. Redstone is second on. and third. Shit. Still on the line. And yeah. the shot rock is is buried right behind those I front just rocks. I wonder if we put another one right up here. Okay. You know the line. Right. This gets to here. Okay, we want, we don't want that there. But it's going to work right, okay? So yeah, because my back eight really works. It's four and a half. Right? Four, four and a half. You've got to get it covered, though, Lindu, because if it stays in the open, you could leave okay a possible double. I don't want to set up a double. Uh, We're shot. We, we have to tack, though, eh? Yeah. We have Thank second and third. Sure. No. No, well, no, 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 no. We have to be front. We have to be like eight foot. Full, full we have eight to be buried. A shot? Little more than full eight. As long as we're buried, it doesn't matter. You guys okay with this? Yeah. It's gonna come here, hey? Yeah, I, it I think so. We're taking come outside yeah. this line for those other ones. So. Four and a half. Four and a half. Yeah. We'll get it there. That's what you love to hear, eh, Lou? <laughs> you put it down, Skipper, and we'll get it there. Just give us something to work with. The front end, oh, Carrie Lynn Shikowski. Karen back Daku. Just for Line's good. Whoa, whoa, and they know can. it will curl whoa, in the four foot right, band close. as long as Line's the weight good. is the whoa, appropriate weight, back, just sweeping weight. No, it's not. Let it work. Yep. Yes, whoa. yes. Now on it. Oh, they left it a bit too long. Sorry. Just 
got here and died. Yeah, line was great. It was bur like it, line was good. Something to be aware of. The line stone is good. Maybe digging a little bit eight. when it starts to catch the curl. They're going to have to be careful again, watching for frost, a little bit of flattening. Although it's early to talk about that, but they will have to be very careful. There's nothing. Everything's too risky. Yep. Hers just died. Her draw looked like it was going to be well, like Well, looked a little four. bit just momentarily over here coming off of this one, but you heard uh, Sanders comment. So think? it's an outturn draw. Yeah, what do you think the weight? In this area, yeah, just to try and get the single point. She had a very good point. Oh, They're talking fully. to her front end. She says her, her draw just absolutely died when it looked like it was going to be top four. Mm -hmm. Draw for one. Mine's good. Wait only. So we'll see if 14 seconds is enough or does it have to be 13 and a half? It's gonna die on you! Hard! Hard! Marcy good or right, Joan McCusker gotta get a little bit further than that. No, you go yes. Was that a no or a yes? <laughs> yeah, that's a yes. <laughs> Couple of extra strokes right at the end. Looked like it got it there. <laughs> wow. Just died, didn't it? Yeah. Absolutely. It absolutely died. Great brushing by the front end of Gooderite McCusker. Keep it going, keep it going. Team Canada gets their first point. They have a 1 0 lead. Saskatchewan will have the hammer when we come back. A little more, a little more when we come back. Welcome back to TSN tonight, everyone. I'm Gino Retta. Hope you're enjoying our live coverage of the Scott Tournament of Hearts from Regina. Send you back to Regina in a moment. Right now, why don't we take a minute and check out on some basketball action. It's the Raptors and the Grizzlies earlier today at Sky Dome. Ten seconds left. Huge Raptors by three. Right Oliver Miller couldn't put it away with a free throw. Air ball. Brutal. So Vancouver with a chance to tie. Five seconds left. Lee Mayberry finds a wide open Pete Chilka. How can you leave him that open? We're going to overtime. But in OT, John Wallace takes over early. Check out the fall away. Over double coverage. He had 22 points. The Raptors go on to win this one in OT. Final score, 113 to 105. News from the Tucson Classic, David Duvall, the big winner, but Glenn Natchik of Selkirk, B.C., strong performance, shot a final round, three under 69, finished in 14th, a pretty good payday for him. All right, hope you're enjoying our live coverage from Regina. Time for a quick break. We'll send you back to more of the Scott Tournament of Hearts right after this. Eileen, I reckon it's time I go into town and get us a new vehicle. All right. has gotten into you. I don't know, but I like it. I'm in love. I'm a I couldn't Some of us thrive in wet situations. Scott towels are no exception. Thirsty Scott towels are so absorbent and strong, you can trust them to soak up quickly, which is a good thing. For most of us, Scott Towels, always thirsty for more. WWF Raw, the clash continues Monday, TSN. Let's play ball. When it comes to complete baseball coverage, even the best think of us first. The Jays return to TSN Tuesday, March 3rd. I wonder if he'll talk about curling. You never know what David Pratt and guests will talk about on Vancouver tonight. Midnight Eastern here on TSN.
An update for you, British Columbia and Quebec. British Columbia opened with one. Hammer in first. Now this is the final stone for Marie Claude Carlos from Alma, Quebec. Boy needed that. She was throwing against four. Hits and sticks, top eight to tie it. 1-1, one, one, BC, Sue Garvey from Kamloops to have the hammer back. Here at the Agrodome in Regina, as we get you caught up on the other scores, here in this fifth draw, still early. PEI, we showed you the four they got against New Brunswick. Still no score, three straight blanks. Alberta, Yukon Northwest Territories. And a great bit of brushing gets Team Canada and Schmirler. A single point, and yeah, so the hammer for the fine. first time of the game belongs to Saskatchewan and Kathy Trell. The first two stones of the end were in the Boise. free guard zone, and there was an yep. attempt to yes. tap, and Hurry. Team Canada stone's in now. Hurry. Hurry. That's the one that Saskatchewan's right making a play on. You can see the other yellow stone whoa, whoa. got tapped clean, up. Clean, clean, Good job. Nice shot. That was a nice draw by Sander. That was not an easy draw. Uh, first of all, you had to go to the other side of the sheet, but that's the, the, that's the, a tip off to the, the, to the ice and to Lloyd and David uh, all day. Why we take our hats off oh. to them? And they've got that uh, you know that especially that uh, middle of the eight to middle of the eight into that area re, you know very consistent oh, and, and uh, the draw weight uh, the curlers have been a little confident with draw weight so it makes a big difference when you know you can go down and. Make a draw, you can then skip around that. I mean, you can skip the game the way you want to skip. It's when you when you fear that draw weight, when it's inconsistent and you just struggle with it, that you really are afraid to play uh, a lot of offense, uh, knowing you may not be able to save it. You know your draw weight, Karen. The only thing we are seeing is the rocks tending to slow very quickly in certain spots, and that means they will have to watch out for any frost creep. Come on, there's a club game at the uh, Cali, I'd say. Ah, it's Trying to split the house. Saskatchewan putting another one on the side. They have the one top 12 foot, partially covered. Easy. Take Karen Daku. It's a good looking team, isn't it? Okay, get it, get it's, it right oh, back. It is, it no, is. Okay. It's right back. <laughs> oh yeah. And that's what sometimes happens. You compensate, overcompensate a little bit. It will stop though. Okay. That's good back there. This email brought to you by Ford from Warren Betker in Weyburn, Saskatchewan. Thanks, Warren. Now uh, cheering for who tonight, you think? Have uh, two club mates ever played against one another in a Scott Tournament of Hearts before? Uh, Subi Campbell, our statistician, has gone back. And in uh, Scott history, in its 17 years, no teams, no clubs have played. The closest he can come up with is teams from the same city. Pat Sanders from Victoria being Team Canada in 88. And then Chris Stevenson, the BC champ, also came from Victoria. That's right, played in Fredericton that year. Oh yeah, hurry! <laughs> hurry! <laughs> hurry hard! So the answer to that question then is no? Right is that the That's right. Right up hard, right up, right up hard, right up. Hurry guys, hurry hard. Hurry, 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 hurry. hurry. Okay, that's fine. Warren, of course, is uh, Jan's brother. That's a, bad, good. that's a bad rollout. There's a chance to lie two in the house. Pick up a deuce. Just remember that will be one of your little stats. Whoa. 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 Here's Sis. Here's Jan Whoa. Becker. Whoa. Shot, Jan. Now, Vic, I always ask you this question. Uh, Are either of those stones fighting? Both look very close. One at three o'clock on the left That's side. No, the top one, maybe. <laughs> I think they're both out. But this is too close to leave. Chrissy Lewis. No, 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 man. Whoa. Clean. No, actually, no, no, We're no, up, no. Catherine, control. Oh, no, right off. No, no, on Big roll. Whoa. Spin. Hmm. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. That's very good. Mm-hmm. 
Jan Bedford, now this is one of those spots on the ice where you say mechanically you have to be well, perfect, yeah. is it? Well, you heard uh, Santa call down. It could be a little frosty down there, so you have to you know, make sure you keep your weight up a little bit. It's a good shot by Jan. And she had it all the way. There was never any doubt about it. When I left her hand, you can tell. Kowski, Daku. Hurry. Hurry, right up, right up. That's Can good. they hold it there? And they will, though, hang it on the edge of the 12. But she did throw all the up weight, so it definitely is we moving there, even with that weight. That's the inside out turn. <laughs> you know, I, I, I just, it just absolutely kills me. Not People sure that don't that know this game and have the nerve to say that it isn't a physical sport. I mean, you, you got a oh, hot man, building, yeah. a warm building, you're brushing every stone, you're playing two, how many other Can't sports play two and three games a day? I mean, give me a break out there. You know, I mean, it's just, it just drives me nuts. A very physical sport. Sure, we're not beating anybody up, but makes it even better. Skip Stones, Sandra Schmirler. Close. Yep. Yes. Yes. Oh, hurry, 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 quick. Precision. Good curling. Yep. All these players coming into the game with a higher hitting percentage, and that's understandable. We saw a little bit of frost yesterday and the uncertainty with draw weight. Sandra yeah. Schmirler coming in with a 91 well, percent takeout percentage, and Kathy Trow with an 84 yeah. percent average. So very good numbers on the hits. The we don't side. expect it to see misses. Well, no, I'm not sure if that one's in or not. We'd have to play that back one. Well, she knows it. I yeah, think that uh, Sandra can know and still be in the rings. I think so. Yeah, that's what I think anyway. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa, pretty firm. Close, close. Whoa. Yep. To the outside, to the outside. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a good shot. And there's your answer. You bet. Right on the beak will leave her just biting the 12. It was coming down. I thought, oh, we're going to be a big ball. I throw it very good, good, that's for sure. Make her make a shot. Okay. But the, the point being, they want to do it one more time. Actually, all depending on if that one is in. If Sander was to know, no, this is good. Okay. the other one was out, then Saskatchewan could nose it back and be outside the rings. All depends on that biter that Vic says is out. Okay. I said it was out too. So he's not alone. And obviously, you're just sitting on the fence. <laughs> like always. <laughs> Betker. And it'll just come up a little short. Change the spot, though, yeah. Linda. Yeah. yeah, well, I threw it bad enough that we could. <laughs> I doubt that, Sandra. I threw that bad enough that we could get the roll, or we could try. <laughs> Maybe a little full and put it back, but she doesn't, she doesn't throw many very badly. Yeah. yeah, it's all this black stuff, hey? So what's Kathy going to do here? Think she's just gonna go for the nose. Uh, she decided that it's out. If she's gonna decide that it's out, she's playing for the blank. But if it's that close, then she'll play for the hit instead. No, we're up control. No. Okay. No. 
Final stone here in three. One nothing. Team Canada leading. And she'll hang around. I don't know. They weren't going to take any chances, were they, Vic? I don't think so. <laughs> it was uh, pretty darn close to being in there. Yeah, they're too close to leave. So they'll one, take their one. Yellow. We're tied 1-1. One, one. When we come back to Rich Island. So he thinks he saved some money. Well, next time I'm calling Allied. Oh, jeez. Thank you, Canada, for making Allied the biggest and best in the country. Yes, it's boredom twitch syndrome. You're lucky. There's a new treatment. Got boredom twitch syndrome? Get relief with Star Choice Digital Satellite Television. Over 90 channels of sports, movies, and entertainment. All with cinema quality picture and CD quality sound. <laughs> You. For a retailer in your community, call now. Finally, the choice is yours. Star Choice. Your car is a high-precision instrument. Take it to AutoPro. With qualified personnel and state-of-the-art equipment, it's the expert on brakes, front-wheel drive, steering, suspension, and mufflers. All protected by AutoPro's national warranty. AutoPro, the largest network of car care professionals. Since the Hendrick Racing Team started using Quaker State, they finished 1-2 in the 96 Winston Cup standings. Finished 1-2-3 this year at Daytona. And they've won at Rockingham, Bristol, Martinsville, and Charlotte. Which makes you wonder, is it in their blood? or in their engines. Quaker State. The quality the Hendrick Racing Team demands. The quality your car deserves. Canadian curling legends have made their mark at the Labatt Briar. But for the first time in years, the battle for the tankard is wide open. Five-time Ontario rep Wayne Midaw headlines a rookie Leighton Field. Catch expanded coverage of all the excitement live from Winnipeg. The 1998 Labatt Briar. See it and live it on TSN. Thursday, the PGA's best tee off at the Nissan Open. Defending champion Nick Faldo leads a top-notch field in Valencia, California. PGA Drama. See it on TSN. Let's begin our updates with British Columbia against Quebec. Sue Garvey against Marie-Claude Carlos from Alma, Quebec. The BC team from Kamloops in a 1-1 tie playing the third. Through the hole. A draw for two already lying one back four. And there it is, two for Garvey, who comes in with a record of one and one, as does Quebec. Prince Edward Island and New Brunswick, four nothing. PEI leading third and final stone. Kathy Floyd from St. John. Nice shot to get it by the guard out in front and hang one on the back for two. It's four to two. Tammy Lowther has the hammer back playing four. Now it's Alberta, Yukon Northwest Territories. Kathy Borst at two and zero. Kelly Kalo from Yellowknife at zero and two. Blank and one, blank and two, blank and three. But this time no blanks says it is Borst from the Otwell in Edmonton. Forced to draw against three all around the 12 foot. With Kate Horn and Brenda Bomer and the good front end. They'll drag it to the top of the eight for one and Alberta's on the board. They lead one nothing. And Kalo from Yellowknife has the hammer for the first time in the game. Saskatchewan takes one in the third. It's tied 1-1. Team Canada, Schmirler to have yeah, the hammer yeah, here in four. Line's first good. stone was out in front. Two come yeah, around the attempts. Mm. Yeah. One just yeah, rubbed. The Team yeah. Canada that's stone just rubbed. And then uh, Saskatchewan rubbed hard. And that meant the two Three. yellow stones split out. Now another come around attempt. Well, I should have played the way I could. Yeah, no, I know. All right, she said she should have played well, the whip. For what she, reason? She doesn't like where it's positioned, Vic. It's behind the T-line. And the wick would have done what, then? Would have moved it to the other side and kept it in front of the T-line. I think it's great. Just bump it 
out. Are you trying to draw? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he can't see it. Hardly, yeah. It looks pretty buried. I think that's what the players yeah, were thinking. I... Tap would be very tough. Yeah, You're not kidding. Karen Daku. Hurry for line. Come on. Wait, it's fine. Hurry for line. Hurry for line. Hurry for line. Come on. Boy, it moves there, doesn't it? Okay, what? We're by. We're by. They definitely found a spot where they can make some nice come arounds. Right to it. Right to it. Whoa. Right to it. Huh? Right to it. I'm going to leave it a little shy. You really love to play the game in front of people like this, people that know curling, people that have lived with curling, grown up, grown up with curling. You know, I, I've said it in many telecasts before, you know, the Scots gave us this Buzz game, away. but yep. the game was uh, grew away. up in Whoa. Western Canada yeah, with yeah, the farmers yeah, and the small rural centers, and back, uh, back everyone in this back, building has back, done back some line. curling at one time or another, and so they really appreciate whoa, the skill that's involved whoa, out whoa, there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Numbers through three Not on Joan said. McCusker and Karen Daku. Not much, though. Karen, the top second coming into the game. I just play this. Yep. Which is almost what you had last time, almost. I like that. Then you could just kind of do this and push this to here. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Basically. Well, they're pretty confident of the, the no. curl there. If they can come across no, the no, face and push it back like that way. Back eight. If you have any more, you're just going to go back on here. Most of them have caught it. There was a couple in the second end okay. that didn't curl so as much, but most of them have caught that movement. Maybe two feet more than last time. Yep. Even your weight you had last time's good. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, scary. Okay, we're thinking coming yeah. to it's not a bad thing. <laughs> well, they've covered everything. <laughs> <laughs> Too much weight. Not straight on it. Tomorrow. Have a ton. That's good. Okay. It's just too much weight, as you mentioned, Linda. Hand roll to here. Okay. Yep. Joan McCusker. In the fourth of a 1-1 one, one tie. Hurry! Hurry! Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No. It's fine. Okay. And straight out the back. They were hoping for a roll. There is a double. We're definitely in hit and roll, Almost too. Almost the nose would get a little bit okay. up here. You might spin on that, but that's OK. Let's go. Control? Control's fine, yeah. Well, Jan Betker's had an impressive game so far. Yes! Yeah. Hurry! Yes. Hurry! Christy Lewis. Hurry she hurry must have started hurry that because you heard the reaction from this end. Yeah. Daku Shikowski. She, she whoa, rolled it whoa, out of her whoa, hand. Whoa. And she'll crash in front and catch nothing on the way by. Yeah, that's, that puts the send in jeopardy. I think you want to play that. It's either that or we go here. I think I like this. Okay. It's a great chance for Sander now. Wait, Team Canada with the advantage uh, of Last I Rock, like line that? two. Oh, 
shots. What do you got? Top house. Oh. Yeah, it's coming right in. No. Well, or four foot. No. Freeze? No, no. That's what you got. No, 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 no. I don't want it on that side. She's in. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry. Some more email brought to you by Ford from Esther Bishop in Halifax, Nova Scotia. What is the difference between control weight and regular normal weight? There's a lot of different terms yeah. for takeouts. The fastest takeout is called a peel when you're normally trying to get rocks yeah, and roll the shooter fine. away as well. Don't that may only take seven and a half yeah. seconds to travel between the hog lines, whereas normal hit probably is closer to nine, nine and a half. Control takes a little bit longer, right? It's a softer hit. Yeah, and, and those are things that you've established in, in your workouts and your practices yeah, and, and, and what the control weight is as compared to the, you know, the normal hitting weight and then as you mentioned, there's the peel weight. So you, you, you predetermine those so that uh, when... Good look at, whoa. Oh, she got the little wick. Gets one. She must have got it started again. That's two in a row that she's got... Uh, that's okay. I'm going to go get you a towel. Towel, something. She's talking about the handle, I guess, because she's... Uh... Kathy. I can't even let go of the rocks. My hands are sticking. Huh? My Does hands are like sticking that? to the rocks. Wait, come on. I can't. They're not... Oh, I suppose even, I even, even if you did, that's not up. bad, but... but... We'll, we'll, we'll watch. There's no question she rolled them both. My hand is stuck she just to got uh, totally them both going, you know, not it's... Not uh... excuses. No, no, it's... Um... Just wipe them off on your shirt. I've tried that. I've tried wiping off my kilt, everything. I'm sweating. Wow, focus it out. It's, it's a but lot it's to do own. with the it's whole situation. Mm -hmm. And it is very warm in here, and you just have to find a coping skill, as Kathy That's said. Right. It's not going to go away, so you have to cope with it. What do you got? Good. Needs it. Okay. Line's pretty good. Well, if you can. No line. Yeah. Line's Unfortunately, good. the one yeah, team yeah. Canada Stone was punched whoa, behind whoa, the corner. Whoa. Whoa, now whoa, Sanders whoa, whoa. putting another one in whoa, front of Shotstone. That's stone. fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's good, Jan. Good shot. Yeah, this is a tough situation for yeah. Team Saskatchewan. Sit this like this and run that back. I think she's got to play this one, uh, Lou. I think. I think she's got to hit this here, and that's what she's going to do, and try and get some action yep. back in here. Hopefully try and get them both if she can. Try and dodge out of this end with maybe only giving up a deuce. The main thing is to get a rock in play here. That's right. If in, she, the, in the top of the house. Sure. Yeah, if she does Go make the double, double or even if she just uh, enroll it here. does the jam, as long as she leaves the Put shooter up here. front, she then has mm -hmm. something yeah, there. Yeah. If Sandra protects, there's a couple possible raises. So <laughs> she wants to save her shooter in this center line <laughs> area. 10,000, 10,000 of them. She's a pretty cool customer. Control, but not down control, yeah. okay? Weight's good? Yep. yep, yep. She's got a nice release. Hurry, Linda, hurry. She, that's a go nice and clean. Whoa, Stays whoa, pretty high. Whoa, whoa, no, Kathy no, 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 no. Little extra weight, it ran a little straighter. Yeah, it just kind of came back. That's all right. <coughs> yeah, do we want to be... Came back on us, eh? Big time. That's okay. You were, like, on this side of the line, and we started sweeping and went on yeah. that side. Of... Yeah. Well, that's that place where they take off this way, too, but... Yeah. Okay, I gave you about there. Do we want to cut behind that guard at all, or no? I think the, I think the line was okay, Sandra. What do, you, what do you think? Yeah, if we cut behind the guard, she might just... You want it? Yeah. Well, what, give you what, a hair uh, less. what Kathy Trow was talking about, there's a lot of movement this way. We've seen a lot of come arounds make big moves this way. And going the other way, she talked about it, you know, it straightened right up, it ran fairly straight. And that's often the case when there's the big movement this way, you'll get a little bit straighter on the other side. This is the same shot I threw in whatever end. If you can put it in the same spot, Jan's yeah. okay. Yeah, you can get the stone right back where it was before. Yeah. Your elbow is just major movement. Really? <laughs> oh, it's like like I'm surprised it's not sprained. <laughs> yeah, I'll need a tensor bandage and chalk. <laughs> I 
can't make mistakes against this team. They make you pay, don't they, Linda? They make you pay. They sure do. Whoa, 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 no lies. And that's what separates the good teams from the mediocre teams. Well, where are we? Frozen? Oh, in front of the team if you can. Frozen to this one? You know, she always shows all the, a lot of anxiety on her face, you know, but when she needs to be there, she's always there. And, and it's, uh, we've careful, seen it now for four or five there. years. That, no, no, that's no. too deep. That gives, uh, ah. gives yeah. Kathy Trell an excellent chance for a double. Three, maybe? Double little roll. It's triple there? No, the tri triple wouldn't be there because you it's then uh, missed the back He's one. Got double, give up a deuce. Same that's way. okay. Make the double. Couldn't agree more. Yeah, I think the weight was good. Weight's just, great. Uh, we, backed it up we backed it. Yeah, just be got to be careful. Okay. It's just kind of a spot there. It's the same spot they go just that's when a, they make their movement. That's what we were just talking Who about. Did you tell us, Trader? This out turn. This double or this double? No, I like this one. I like this okay. one. Christy just confirming they're playing that straight back double as opposed to the two stones that are pretty even. Which one would you play? The, the other one's a little easier, but... Uh, oh. Oh. I play the straight back and oh. try and leave the shooter in position to make it tougher for Sandra. Yes! Tchaikovsky, Taku, straight back, get it, jammed it. Tough one. Draw for three. Yeah. First and it's exactly the same shot right and about there. Yeah. The other double was a little It'll easier to make. There. It'll cut that much. Oh, yeah. I can freeze right down to that yeah. one. Okay, let's go. It'll move that much, won't it? Yep. Kathy got a little unfortunate on both oh, yeah. hits because uh, one went that much straight and That'll move that the other much, one jammed. As long as they don't yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, for sure. yeah. we just give us a Well, there you see mum. Kathy, Joan's mom. That's Joyce Inglis. Karen Inglis, her sister, or their sister, is on the right. And uh, it's interesting, they've had special shirts made up, half red, half green. One half says uh, Schmerler team on it, the other one says Trowel. So we know that uh, their loyalties are split this week and in this game, especially. What do you got? Line's fine. Well, there was two misses by the third. Christy Lewis, Close and that uh, is the no, 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 no. second and third point. Oh God, like can't uh, if they can make it. And if this one's going to stop. Okay. Tap and bumps it back and too far. So three becomes two. Yeah. Sanders Schmerler misses the opportunity. Kathy Trowell escapes, giving up just a pair. It's three to one, Team Canada ahead. Waiting for the fish to bite, you think about how smart your daughter has gotten and how much your son is starting to look like you. And you wonder why you never noticed until now. But you might as well head back to camp. The fish seem to be as relaxed as you are. Rediscover your family while you discover North America. Recreation vehicles. Wherever you go, you're always at home. Call today for a free brochure or visit an RV dealer near you. Your room 1056. Enjoy your stay. Thank you. This way to Why? You got my notebook! Excuse me! Hey! Hey! To Sheila, <laughs> tough enough for today's world. Call 1 800 387 5645. It's the way we welcome the sun with 35 Sunblock. The way some of the best water now mostly comes in bottles. It's the way we make time for exercise and like to enjoy reading. Today, more and more people are finding reasons to take better care of themselves. That's why Subway offers seven subs, each under six grams of fat. Because when you're through surfing, you might want to go for a swim. Subway, it's the way a sandwich should be. McCain brings you the freshest tasting frozen pizza ever made. McCain Pizza Premiere in the unique 
vacuum-packed flavor lock package that seals air out so it stays fresher tasting longer. It cooks in just half the time and has a tender no-mess rim. So whenever you're ready for pizza, McCain Pizza Premier is ready for you. In fresh tasting deli lovers, pepperoni, and deluxe. McCain Pizza Premier, we've got a lock on fresh taste. Let's continue our updates with Prince Edward Island, New Brunswick, 4-2 PEI leading. Final stone for Tammy Lowther in the fourth. PEI at one and one. So is New Brunswick, Kathy Floyd from Thistle St. Andrews in St. John. And looking at the angle double, can't get it. Steal of one for New Brunswick. It's 4-3 PEI with the hammer playing five. Alberta, Yukon Northwest Territories, 1-0 Alberta leading as they play five. Final stone for Kelly Kalo and her team from the Yellowknife Curling Club. Hits, sticks back eight for one. They're tied 1-1. Playing very quickly, they've gone to their fifth end break in a 1-1 tie with Kathy Borst from Edmonton. Here in Regina. And the 98 Scott Turnout of Hearts, British Columbia leading Quebec 3-1 as they play five. And Team from Alma, Quebec, with the hammer. So Canada has a chance. Schmerler oh, for three. Oh, no. Settles for two. Close. Close. Trowell might consider no. herself fortunate. Yeah, I think so. I, I'm surprised at, at, at the call. Sandra, th oh, obviously, yeah, with the two point good. lead through the rock and the rings, and uh, Shot, Mars. Uh, Kathy hit it. I thought she might throw up a corner. Well, she's shown to be very patient. It might have been different if that third point was scored. When you're down two and have the hammer, you feel like you can be a little more patient mm -hmm. and wait for the opportunity for two. Okay. Yep. Carrie Lynn Schakowsky. Okay. Yeah, yeah, good point. You don't have to push the button, but I, Hurry. you know, my theory on waiting. Hurry, right up. Uh, yeah. I, I have the, right I'm up. not suggesting I'm correct on it. I'm just right saying up, guys. Right up. I have this thing about I don't like to wait to run through. You know, next thing you're in the fifth, you're in the sixth, you're in the seventh, and you got good. No, I definitely wouldn't wait many either. Marcy put the first one basically on the button, and that's why Saskatchewan hit it. No, I don't think they'd, if it happened again, they might play the tap on it. I don't think they'd be hitting it all the time. Oh shit, is that gonna go in or out? Well, if I sweep it, it'll stay in. If you sweep it, it'll stay it's in still too. Stay in. <laughs> Now draw or hit. This well, is you, a chance. You've got to draw to this, yeah. You, you, yeah. you got to play the corner. This is what you wait for if you're you wanting to hit that first one because it's Nancy, in the four-foot button area. No, Are you want to do this? I like yeah. it. She knows her weight, eh? Okay. Yeah. You could also play the corner guard here. I mean, I, I on this side, too, I'd play it. And, and, and see what Sandra is going to do. Okay. Just to... Karen Daku. No backing. No backing. Yeah, right to the T line. Get as far as it'll go. As far as it'll go, right to the T line. Right to the T line. Come on. Right up. Right up. Right up. Right up. That's good. That's good way, Karen. Good sweep, guys. It's only running 23 and a half, really. Prefer to have taken it right down to it? Yeah, they wanted to freeze to it. Yeah. Well, you well, like, you've well. got to like that kind of a call, don't you? Well, well yeah, I like the call. I would have well. I would have even played the corner guard. Well. Yep, no, that's yep, just me. Yep, yep, yep. Atta girl, good throw. She probably down. thought she was tight, but she threw it good. I mean, you're not bothered by those Linda just hanging around on the edge like that? No, not at all. No, at the moment, uh, there are opportunities. Now Kathy is going to hit them, but they're... Only in the 12 foot, you have the hammer, you have the whole eight foot open, it's a good opportunity. No, no! Little up jump, turn, 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 turn. That's good. Uh oh, I ticked that one. I was up a bit, hey? Sandra, uh, I ticked it. In front of the tee. One of the things I fear when you play the good teams like this, this is the best, 
um, is that they, they maneuver you. Eight. You know, and, and I, I think right that if you're going to beat those good teams, you have to try and maneuver them a little bit. And uh, Sanders got herself in a position now where she right got the two perfect, points. Yes, it could have been three, but uh, she, you know, she's kind of maneuvering the game a little bit Not her way, and she's got uh, things going. And I think that uh, now obviously Kathy's decided to wait a few ends to be aggressive, but. Uh, Center is the best at this. She kind of maneuvers you into playing the way she wants to play. And, uh, Let's see if uh, yep. Christy Lewis has gotten her nerves in whoa, check. Whoa, then. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Remember in the last end, she was yeah. complaining about way? sweaty palms, go, not go, being go, able go. to uh, let the rock go. Makes the hit, sits top 12. Great news for those of you who are online. You'll get a chance to uh, talk to this lady, Jan Becker, the third for Team yep, Canada, yep. will join you online after the game. You'll have a chance to Hold talk on. to her about Quick, Team Canada, it, about the gold Hold medal win in Nagano, Quick, and even Quick, this game, how Quick. it turns out. Nope. And of course, the online, online chat is available on the TSN web address www.tsn.ca slash curling to talk with Jan Betker. Kathy's obviously decided to try and play through this end and get the blank, Linda. Did you agree with that? Yeah, she made the one chance, uh, had the one chance, made the one play to be a little aggressive when she tried to draw earlier. That spot where she is is a little bit difficult because they tried the draw and it doesn't quite get out to that side of the 12 foot. They haven't groomed it tightly enough, let's put it that way, to get out there. And they've had a couple of hits run very straight. So they may later in the game prefer to play that corner guard because it may be the better opportunity to get something going when the stones are that far over. And she may have wanted to get uh, Christy Lewis through a couple you can go of behind an or so too after you know, pretty much turning those two intern it. shots over. So that's another another thing that a skip will do. Lots of skips will do to try and get you and give them, make sure that you have a couple of easy shots after you've made some of those. And well, I shouldn't say that. I don't know. She's gonna hit it. Okay. Can so get your confidence back. Absolutely. That was far too heavy on that one. All, all these players and the majority of these players are mechanically so sound. The game is 95% in the head, and, and uh, it's a game of touch and feel. And, when you struggle with the, the releases or you struggle with the yeah. feel, whatever it may be, it can be really frustrating. Feline. Boy, that's a familiar scene, isn't it? Those two brushing. Feline, yep, yep, yep. That's good. That's good. There was a marvelous picture on the uh, cover of the Nagano newspaper yeah. of. Uh, nice Sandra coming out and, and Jan and, and uh, Marcy in position brushing and it was just a terrific okay. picture. And, it's a better jam there than it is over there. That's pretty wide open. In fact, we're setting ourselves yeah, Great for coverage for our sport so to all the other people that were there. Right. In Actually, the watch Olympics. It. it may go hard at the end. Yep. Yeah. It was a better draw by Sandra. She had two of the last end that went a little bit deep. You guys want to borrow my towel? I'm going to roll it that way. <laughs> the sweat, go ahead. Otherwise, oh, just it's a little warm in here, huh? Isn't it off? I thought it was a sweat that was hanging on yeah, the rocks and so I made turns, but I guess it was my elbow. <laughs> Sometimes. Christy seems a little more relaxed now. Actually, it was good. Kathy yeah, was very good yeah, with her last end and had a little so bit of a chuckle yeah. about the fact that she just thought it was. Uh, turning her arm over. We all do it on occasion, so they seem a little more relaxed now. Three to one, Team Canada lead here in five. And Saskatchewan and this lady have the hammer. Whoa, whoa, right off. Close. That's good. That's a good shot. That's fine. I think that weight's up well from control. Well, Ray, you were wondering about the a crowd and saying it was 7,200. Well, it's a record attendance Ooh. for any single draw in Scott history. 7,346. The previous high, as you see, was Brandon in 93. In fact, it is the largest attendance of any sporting event to be held in the Agridome. So congratulations to the organizing committee. That's and, amazing. And, uh, yeah, in fact, uh, remember today you... you uh, 
Oh, uh, now his name escapes me. Former uh, Blue Bomber coach was here. Cal Murphy. Cal Murphy, pardon me. He was here because Danny McManus is being courted by the Rough Riders, the quarterback formerly of Edmonton, and is being courted by the Rough Riders, Tiger Cats, and Argos. And he was in town, and he was here and had a look at the curling. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah. I'm sure he got to see the kind of support that the Rough Riders oh. get here in Saskatchewan, oh. the football uh, yeah. team. Uh, oh. Rough Rider pride, okay. that's for sure. That's okay. Nah. I screwed up with my first one. Sandra's <laughs> always so tough on herself. <laughs> yeah, she was a little bit lighter on her first one, and now a nose hit on this one well, will be outside the house. Anymore. I think it was a little up control. We need a little, like, we need to make sure it gets to the face, so. Sandra's rock had been deeper. The exchange of hits would have meant Kathy would have had to blank by rolling quite a distance, actually. This way, just a nose hit will do it. I think the crowd, though, was expecting more yep, out yep. of this. Am I? Well, it's yeah, a kind of yeah. game, too. Huh? I mean, well, I think three, I think right that uh, Kathy Trowell right decided to just play this yeah, end open and wide. Right up, right up, and right up, I think you're right going to see it. I mean, right I, if, if she thinks she can it's run it's through a few ends and not force this Canadian this Canadian team, the best team in the game, then she's just kidding herself. So I think she'll, she'll liven things up. A blanket five means Trowell and Saskatchewan will hold on to the hammer. We played five. Team Canada, Sandra Schmerler with a 3-1 lead midway through this fifth draw in Regina. Welcome back to TSN Tonight, everyone. I'm Gino Retta, back to Regina for some more live curling momentarily. Right now, let's check out some basketball action. Lakers and the Magic. Once upon a time, Shaquille O'Neal was bigger in Orlando than Mickey Mouse himself. But then he took the cash and went to L.A. Today, he went back to Orlando for the first time since he left two years ago. What kind of reception do you think he got? Obviously, not a great one from his perspective. Game done at the half, third quarter. Shaq goes to work. Jams down his own miss. O'Neal finishes with 20. But with 10 seconds to go, Nick Anderson, three-pointer, good! Anderson finishes with a game-high 30. And then went into some kind of weird convulsion. Not exactly the kind of return Shaq wanted. Orlando fans just loving it. They defeat Shaq in his return by two points. Other action, the battle of the Canadian basketball teams. This edition went to Toronto, 113-105 in OT. Back to Regina after this. Another Nokia discovery. Small words are hard to read, which is why at Nokia we make our screens big, so they're easier to read. Inspired technology with a human touch. Nokia. Connecting people. has gone to great lengths to give you a longer-lasting bathroom tissue. Purex Double Roll. With twice as many pillowy soft sheets on every roll, it takes forever to run out. Purex Double Roll. Pillowy softness that lasts twice as long. Canadian curling legends have made their mark at the Labatt Briar. But for the first time in years, the battle for the tankard is wide open. Five-time Ontario rep Wayne Madaw headlines a rookie Leighton Field. Catch expanded coverage of all the excitement live from Winnipeg. The 1998 Love Back Briar. See it and live it on TSN. Well, the weather has been absolutely wonderful. Plus three, plus four. On the scoreboard, it's 3-1 Team Canada. Reminder, stay with us right after the game for the TSN Turning Point, brought to you by Super 8 Motels. We deliver great quality, time after time. Same, Same with, with Super, Super 8. 8. Every room is comfortable. comfortable. And roomy. Super 8. Super 8. <laughs> Life's, Life's great, great at Super 8. 8. Anita Ford, the coach of this gold medal winning team, 
Atina Ford, their fifth player, fifth end break. Yeah, and they lead 3 oh. 1 over Saskatchewan. Then let's take a look at the numbers after five. We've had a little bit of everything, two blank ends, no steals, of course, at this point, and we've been trying to watch some of the draw percentages, and Team Canada has a bit of an edge there, although some of their rocks also sliding into positions that they weren't terribly happy with. Team Canada overall with that superior percentage. Remember a couple of hits, Kathy Trowell, the first end missed a hit, Christy Lewis in the last end missed a couple, so they've been struggling a little bit, but with the score still pretty close, lots of chance in the second five to come back for Saskatchewan. Well, all the games in this fifth draw have reached the fifth end break. We'll update them when we come back to the Agrodome here on TSN. And he thinks he saved a bundle on the move. Yeah, right. Ugh. Next time I'm calling Allied. Thank you, Canada, for making Allied the biggest and best in the country. When AT&T Canada started this dime time thing, I said to myself, dime boy, you got to be a part of this. Call anyone in Canada any evening, any weekend for a dime or less. Who needs the phone? Dime time someone you love, OK? I'm no hero. I'm just trying to get Canada talking. One dime at a time. New dime time, only from AT&T Canada. <laughs> Did you see the look on his face? Hey, here comes another one. Come to Papa. Wait, not a Ford Contour. That thing's got more moves than a cat. And it's so quick. What do they think we are, Greyhounds? Come in and test drive the newly restyled 1998 Ford Contour. One drive will surprise you. Hey, you guys up for a little Italian? <laughs> Another case of boredom twitch syndrome? Nothing relieves boredom twitch syndrome like Star Choice Digital Satellite Television. Over 90 channels of movies, sports, and entertainment. All with cinema quality picture and CD quality sound. <laughs> Honey, our favorite movie! Oh, thank you. For a retailer in your community, call now. Finally, the choice is yours. Star Choice. Thursday, the NHL's best are back on TSN. Catch an original six matchup between the Leafs and the Rangers. And best of all, there's no time change. Molson NHL tonight. Check it out on TSN. The 1998 Scott Tournament of Hearts from Regina, Saskatchewan on TSN is brought to you by Scott Towels. Always thirsty for more. Welcome back. Vic Crowder along with Linda Moore, Ray Turnbull, and our entire crew. Glad that you're with us. While our game is still in its fifth end break, we want to check in on the game between Alberta, Kathy Borst from the Otwell in Edmonton against Kelly Kalo, the Yukon Northwest Territories, Illinois Curling Club. Tied 1-1 as they play the sixth. And Borst makes the hit and stick top 12 for a single and now a 2-1 lead. She's having a chuckle because she was inside the broom and she knew it. The sweepers held it long enough to get by the guard. Let's get you caught up now in all the other scores that have passed the midway point and are started the sixth end of play. British Columbia leading PEI by one over New Brunswick as they play six. There's the updated score Alberta. And in a case of perfect timing, we can get right back to our game and see the first stone from. Shot, Mars. Good. Team Canada lead, Marcia Gooderite. 
Okay, here's a here's a change in strategy. She could go up and throw up the corner, but she's just going to play the freeze to it. So she'll try and generate her points, her extra points. She, the strength of last rock, she feels she has one, so it's a 3-2 game. So looking for the second point, she'll do that by trying to utilize stones that are in the rings, no tapping line. them back, freezing to the face. Most teams have a strategy for the no, end. No depending on where the first stone is positioned. Because that one was on the button, I'm assuming Kathy now feels that her best play is to make the tap back, yeah, good. try Sorry, and get guys. something going in the rings. If the stone yeah, hadn't been positioned quite as well, she probably would have thrown up the corner. And I'm sure they talked about that in the fifth end break. Close. Yep. Marcy, the Close. native of Moose Jaw. Close. That certainly tells you what you have to play now. Still don't mind this. Frosty house? No, no, I'm just oh, call it back. Call it, yeah, okay. she's got, she's got to move it off That's of here. not bad, Kath. Okay. Tap it back. Let's go for it, guys. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Last waiting. Eh? Let's yeah. Terry Lynn Schakowsky works for the Royal Bank. And they were calling out a little bit more weight, and that one just tapped the stone back. Elsie Moronic oh. School. No! Please. Here Please. in Regina is where Joan yeah. teaches. Oh, 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 there's a mural oh, oh. Oh. on the walls oh, here oh. from the children at the school. She was asked to pick it out, and it's exactly what she did. <laughs> Everybody plays a different role on a team, and there's no question that yeah, okay, actually, yeah. Joe McCusker yeah, is kind of the, the glue of this team. It keeps everybody all together, keeps everybody loose. for the Saskatchewan Economic Development Office. Yep. More than hack, I think. As we play well, second then. stones in yep. the sixth then. Whoa, no, no, whoa, 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 whoa. Yep. Not more than hack. Go oh, wall? Yep. Yeah. No, 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 no. That's all right. Yep. That last one, they were hoping it would come to the face and sit in front of the Team Canada stone. Everything really going Team Canada's way this end. Rocks yeah, nicely whoa, whoa, spread whoa, whoa, whoa. out. Whoa, whoa. Nice shot, Joan. Atta girl. Great nice. shot. She's Just in. a reminder, sorry. No, no, I, You sorry. can get caught up on the NBA with Brendan Connor in the paint coming up Monday at 5.30 p.m. Eastern time here on TSN. The Raptors beat the Grizzlies today. Linda. I won't take that personally. Karen Daku. Back house. Back 12. Okay. 
Not bad. Slide. I didn't quite catch what she said, actually. She said, oh, dear, I, I don't know. She felt she didn't come out well, but she should try and come out that way every time because she certainly hit the broom and she made the shot. That's right. So sometimes you just feel you don't get it down or your balance is a little shaky. And Christy works for West nope. Jet. We're close. No, no. Back four. The wick and a roll over here, maybe. No, 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 no. no. Not too bad. Okay. No. Oops, sorry, Sandra. The only problem with all these tap backs, they're not really establishing the little Our wall that they dead. hope to behind the Yellowstone. The Yellowstone has a clear path to exit the house that's what jan will try to do that was the uh, the right oh, weight for all oh, those shoes that just didn't yeah. grow enough for and out the back avoiding a couple of stones you could have jammed it on jan vetker Shot, Jan. I'm just going to draw down to the one on the forefoot. It starts to become a dicey situation because you're leaving the rock at the top of the forefoot, the rock that was just thrown by Jan Betker. And I'll tell you, if you ever happen to miss a shot here, you're really going to be in trouble. No, we're out here. No. Yeah, you don't mind the ones building up at the back of the no. house yep. because they yep. can actually be used to your advantage. But that one top eight is tough. Karen right Jakowski right closes on. to the stone. Right Karen right Dak, who is out in front. Push hard, guys. Push hard. Right up. Right up. Come they on. got out push a little hard. wide, huh? Push hard. Push oh, hard. now there's trouble. Okay. Now you're in deep trouble. That was new ice, too. We hadn't seen any outturn uh, play out there. The That's why I, didn't, uh, I was nervous about that one. Even if I sit right in front of it. Yeah. I like that, yeah. She had to be down to it. So top, top 12 is good, too. So at least we have the double tap if she happens to do yeah, something, right? This, so. Well, then we can double tap it. Well, if I tap it, that's fine. Yeah. She's just okay. going to smash away, so. Okay. Frozen or anything. Yeah. The one thing, what I don't want to do is play a tap and then, you know, open it up yeah, or whatever. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. So let's just play this kind of way. And hopefully get on this side of it if we can. Right? So if she plays a double, she'd not get the back one. She's going to tap this one here back, but you heard what she said. What I don't want to do in any way is come down. I want to be right that. in there. Yeah. Come down top, here and tap eight. this one and open it up in here. In other words, hit it on the outside yeah, I don't and kind of sit here and go there. Leave her so. Because now you open the area up and let, uh, let Kathy get in. So she just wants to touch it back. Even if she sat just in front yeah, of it. Yeah, so it's you know, up to you guys. Top eight weight. Yeah, Christy just could not be short on that. Had to be down to it. Sandra is currently on maternity leave from the Southeast Leisure Center here in Regina. Way looks good. That's a nice shot. They're hoping to leave them a little bit more one in front of the <laughs> yeah, other in it, case it, she actually, needs to use it. it just, yeah. yeah. But it's an awfully good situation for the Redstones at the moment. Kathy's in big I trouble. I how I'm going to get one last shot. That's why I'm wondering if I clear that off. And then she's not going to be yeah. able to guard my raise back and right. and a draw, right? I think that rock there is, it is there. You're hitting roll there. 
Which one? You hit and roll on the intern right there, number six. No. Number six doesn't help me. I can't get shot rock off of number six. I'm going back. You sure? Yeah. I think yeah. you'd end up back in here. I don't think so. Uh, I think she's got, she's, the intern, she's got to go in here. Take the intern, I'm end up back. I think it's their calf. They're talking about hitting the one in the that. eight foot and rolling in. Because if I try clearing that, right? If I clear that off, then I've got two, two, two to raise. Kay. And I've got a rock in play. Okay. You've got, you you got, got to play those. you got to play those two. What do you think of this? So that, then at least I've got this one and that one. And this hit and roll. Huh? You ever played the outside with I, Melanie? I need, missed I need to open the forefoot somehow. These this way. I need I two agree. shots. I agree. Got two shots. Take this off. Either okay, one's fine, forward. whatever you think, Cap. She hits this just off to center. To She'll drive it onto this one here. Two, so That'll go two. that way. Okay, normal. That'll go that way. And she's got it open. open it she, she's got to play this. She cannot have got to play this, this shot here. That's a, it's a must. I liked your point that she's trying to save the shooter somewhere top 12 foot, and then uh, if Sandra does guard, she has the little tap. Yep. Hit, hit this right on the nose is a good shot, Linda. And then she's going to have to play me, and then I'll have either a jaw or a raise. Okay? Okay. okay. I need something on my last shot. Yeah. I, need, I need a last shot. You'll get it. Yeah. Think it'll come that much? I think it'll come. Yeah. Do you yeah. think? Just tighten that ice a little bit. I think it'll no, tight. tighten it. Tighten it a little bit. It's going to keep the weight up. And we talked about that. The minute you throw the weight up, it runs pretty straight. But there's been movement with this intern. Yep. Three. Three guys. Three. Three. Right now, she's facing six. Get rid of something. Gets roll. rid of one. Right over, Karen. Get it. Right over, Karen. Oh, yeah. She took mm -hmm. it over. For that weight, she didn't have enough ice. No, she tightened. No, she tightened the ice, and it probably ice. was just fine the way it was. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Yeah. One. But okay. She's got a full draw. Yeah. She's got a draw here. If we guard, what's she gonna play? A hit and roll off that. Yeah. Tap it into here. Yeah. Would be great. And then my shooter is a little bit yeah. on this side, eh? Yeah. I like that. Never shot. Nope. Like bite the back of the button. Yeah, I cut there. That's Half rock, right? Because I, I... Well, we can't cut the face, so that would be no. the worst thing. We could overcut. But that looks pretty close. And if... No, I'm going to try and throw the same weight, and if yeah. I stop in front of it, even if I freeze oh, yeah. it here... Yeah, that's fine. Nothing wrong with that. I just yeah. want to be on this side of it a bit if I'm just playing the freeze. Like well, she's got that thing, but that's hard shot. Let her, Let play, her try it. It. play it. Play it, tap. <laughs> I like tap. So, Let her have like, it. I'm not quite sure what weight to throw now because that last one you thought I had T line. If we would have swept it though, we would have kept the momentum going into she that has frost. To have yeah. This one here. Just throw the back same weight. Here. Your weight was great. Yeah. And try and sit right there. Touch more. Why not try and tap it straight back and put more. it right in the loop? Yeah, we just can't overcut. And that's the shooter sitting there. Uh, and if I'm light, that's fine. There it is Light's right fine. now. Mm -hmm. That would be fine That's too. A she doesn't want to open way. it up. Same Same anything. Weight. I mean, Kathy's in big trouble. She's got maybe a hit and roll. She's got maybe a tap on the yellow top eight foot, but they're very tough shots. Whoa. She's in deep trouble. Whoa. 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 Might be lost weight. Whoa. 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 It's okay. It's okay. This could be the game. Line's okay. Yep. Yeah. Good. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> you make mistakes against this team, and that's why they're three-time world champions and gold medalists. You make mistakes nice against this team, and they just jam it right down your throat. Does that make that and This end is an for? absolutely Come perfect on. example. Well, this is why they win gold medals. This is why they win world championships. They, you give them a chance, boy, and they just jam it to you. She makes it, at least we held her to one. <laughs> Made her make a tough shot. So. Make a tough mm -hmm. shot. Goodness gracious. Sander was a little unhappy because this raise back now is into a bit of a pocket, but look at that. Uh, trying the raise on the Yellowstone top eight foot and obviously have to angle it into the button area. Tap the ones back that are there.
Angle raise against four. And one of the hard things of this shot, uh, Linda, is that we haven't played a lot of outturn hits out here. And you've got to play it with a little bit of weight. There's no room for error on a high one at all because they have a court. I'm going to give you like half weight and it should run straight down. Okay. Now the most recent shot we've Let's seen in this spot right is Christy Lewis's draw mm -hmm. attempt, and it came up short. She didn't get much of a read from that one. I heard Kathy say hack weight should run straight. I think she's right about the straight part. I think she needs We're a little more than hack weight. Yes! Hey! Right out of her hand, it's Shikowski. Hey! Daku hey! hey! have to fight hey! now to get it by the guard. Hey! Got it by, angle it into the pocket. Wow, that's a great shot to hold this team and give up just one. She was facing four. Kathy Trowell making the best of an absolutely bad situation. The angle into the pocket. She gets rid of everything but one. Schroeder's on top now. 4-1. No, 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 no. CIBC's Fun Family has been called one of the best fun families in Canada. All my fund managers are performance driven. I'll do what it takes to make our funds perform. That's my contribution. Canadian Imperial Bank of Commerce. Seeing beyond. What's going on in there? Just bathroom stuff, Mommy. Cardinal. Feel the cardinal softness. longer. Duracell. Energizer. Duracell. Energizer. Duracell. Energizer. Duracell. 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 Recent tests proved that Duracell Energizer. outlasts Energizer. Better make it the alkaline battery proven to last longer. Better make it Duracell. I first started on a rink just like this. Elvis Stoiko knows what it takes to be a champion. It takes hard work to deliver a top performance. Like McCain Frozen Punch delivers the real fruit taste of real fruit juice for champions like Elvis Stoiko. McCain Frozen Punch in a choice of thirst-quenching flavors like grape, orange, and fruit punch. So get the jump on taste, the year-round taste of real fruit juice in McCain Frozen Punch. McCain, now that's top taste performance. Thursday, the PGA's best tee off at the Nissan Open. Defending champion Nick Baldo leads a top-notch field in Valencia, California. PGA drama. See it on TSN. Well, this was the first of three draws a day, and we have three draws all the way through round robin for you. So tomorrow, Monday, 10 a.m. Eastern time, Kelly Kahlo, Yukon Northwest Territories, Yellow Knife against... Lois Fowler from Brandon, Manitoba. That's our game in draw six and our first of three on Monday. Four sheets in play here at the Agrodome on this Sunday night in the fifth draw. The featured game is on the extreme right.
BC Quebec is playing on A. It's PEI New Brunswick on B. Alberta Yukon Northwest Territories on C. And this is our featured game, of course, on D. Team Canada and Saskatchewan. Sandra Schmirler now up 4 1 after the steal of one in six. Marcy Goodright started a little slowly in this game. A couple of come around she didn't make, but since then, first stone, top four foot, automatic, it seems now. That's exactly where Team Canada wanted it. The guard did go up, and another nice come around by Marcy into the four foot area. So Saskatchewan always having to deal with those early stones. So nice shot. More. I don't mind peeling the gap. Come on, just peel the guard. Sure. I don't like that if we jam that at all. No. Let's just peel this guard. Yeah. This is a good call. This is the good call. Joan McCusker. Yep. Rolled as far as they can. That's good. It's good, John. Good. You could duck in behind that, though. Got a chance here. What do you think of this? I don't mind drawing around. I don't think I'd play down near the other no. ones yet. You could, you could play another guard. You could you could play behind the corner. She wants to just tunnel coming down here, but you could go here and behind this one here. Okay, we can punch that straight yeah. back. Yeah, yeah that's back. fine. But you only need T-line weight. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, that's just T-line yeah. weight. T -line just Play down on this one. Just touch this rock back onto the face of this one here. The only reason I wouldn't do this at this point, it's very early, and Sandra likes the fact that uh, that lineup might be moved around, and maybe the Saskatchewan Stones actually will get in a better position to get rid of them. I might be tempted to do the come around at this point. Yep. Yep. Hurry for line. Karen Daku. Hurry for line. Yep. Here in the seventh as we play yeah, yeah, yeah. the second right up, stones. Right up. Right up. Hurry for line. Wait up. Hurry. Hurry. We're losing line. Come on. Wait up. Wait up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait up. 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 Our back one's going to go. Yeah. Whoa! No. No. That's good, Joan. Shot. Okay, Joan. She'll pick one out of there, the high one. Now do you go behind the corner, Linda? I would be. I, I, I like the corner call too. You, you and I are going to be able to play together. <laughs> you better pre pretty soon though, I'm getting kind of old. <laughs> Not sure who we'd get to play on the team with us, mind you. <laughs> no, that, you know, we're pretty, we're pretty brave with this telestrator. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> you gotta we go, put one right here. You got to go out there and play the shots. Yeah. Last more. It's a good call. It's gonna behind the corner, try and get this buried. Right up, gotta be in. Come gotta on. be in his right. Come Got on. to be in the rings. Shikowski closest guys. to Come the on. stone. Lewis out in front. Nice and even. Four to Come one. On. Team nice Canada leading. Nice and as you look at that scoreboard, nice you even. know that it could be nice a lot even. worse for nice Saskatchewan. Right Great job, way. Huh? Just she just took too much ice and didn't get it close enough to the guard. Point is big here. You can score two, a deuce yep. here. Kathy Trial gets herself, you know, four three. It's uh, it's whoa. it's on. The game's on whoa, again. Yep. Yep. Whoa, whoa. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Oh, rats. I screwed up. That's good. Nice shot.
We get pretty tired after one of these games. It's a lot of thinking. But I think ahead to what, if you do something, what the opponent will counter with. Kathy looking at these, thinking maybe about coming down on top of that red one, top four foot. I wonder if we do this. If you angle froze on the red one, Linda. What if you angle time throws out? on this one right here? See, she's got this to tap onto here, right? Do you want to call timeout? Right? Hmm? Call timeout? Why is our time tight? Well. No, don't look at it. It's okay. We can do this here. We don't want to set up a double, right? set up right? a double if I come here, though. But if we're here, yeah, that's yeah, not so good. Yeah, that's, that's so that's not a lot of room right there, though. It's not a lot of room. If we do this, well, we we're setting up a double. Like, if we hit that and roll here, we're still setting up a double, and then we lose this one. Yeah, we get shot out of it. But then she's in front. Hey, why don't we corner freeze right here? Yeah. All right. Yeah. I, I like the Well, no, here. because we've got to get two out of this. If I throw is right here, that's that's good, but yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, like I, I think I think that's what we have to do. Yep. So we got to get two out of it. Okay. So they're going to play a freeze, but to which stone? Well, I I, I, th I think they may be freezing to their freeze own. To but, it. I think so. But uh, um, I don't. I have to be on this side. I don't know where. If, we're corner freezing on the front one's gonna hurt you, to be honest eight. with you. If, yeah, I don't think Sandra is going to be so playing it too cute because she's up three. Yeah, I, I we'll guess if you there. thought they were going to try and protect or something, you may not get a chance to get at the forefoot, but I don't think Sandra is going to do that. Well, Christy Lewis really focused in now. She said, I can do this, and you know that she's trying to pick Look, up her game. Because mine's it's good. Her game that has, nope. Actually, it has to work. left this team a little Let it work. short so far. Yeah, it's been okay, a difference. Jan Becker's just outplayed uh, nope. whoa, whoa. Christy. Yep, yeah, team. Things can turn yep. around. Whoa. Nope. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurry. Hurry, 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 hurry. Good. Perfect. Yeah. Just missed a line. Okay. Good girl. Are we? Okay. Shot. It turned out perfect for them. Uh, you can't play anything on it. Yeah, it did, it did turn out well, didn't it? You got the perfect yeah. freeze on it, yeah. Got nothing, honey. We're on third's last rock. Unless we just play an O's, get rid of our back one. And That's then what we'll I think I would do. Years. And then we'll have two in front of there, you know what I mean? Yeah. If we play yeah. an O's on that top one, that's not so bad. Get rid of this back one. It's doing us no favors anyway. Oh, no, it's terrible. Yeah. We don't want to give up three here, but how do we not give up three? I think we have to play it and then play a nose on this. This one's going to spin into here. The number two. Yeah. Well, it's this is your last rock, right? Just gets stuck there. We can't guard because then she just oh, no, comes no, no. tap tap. No, 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 can't guard. Well, I guess we could guard because how does she get? We sit here. Oh, no, then she just picks that out and she's laying two, right? I guess we have to play only give up a deuce here, right? Right? Yeah, okay, if I hit that one on the nose, they're not gonna be frozen anymore. Right, and then we can play something. Okay. It'd be nice to get right to our nose, though. Like, right on the nose. Yeah, time, time out. The first of two one minute timeouts called Tina. by Team Canada. We're second, they're third. Yeah, that's what I, we were looking on the screen. Yeah. I think we have to hit this on the nose. Yeah, I get think we, this, I think we gotta gonna, get rid of it. They're gonna lie too, though. Well, well let them lie too. Coach, you need a Ford. But then ours is, yeah, yeah. yeah. Tina Ford, yeah. fifth. Yeah. I know. This one is really, Yeah, this yeah. one's possible. No, nothing. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Other than playing a guard, I don't yeah. like that. Yeah, no, I agree. If we play this, if you, if you, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can save that. Yeah. Yeah. You think with this? It might spin, yeah. Oh, no, 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 that one, two's not going anywhere. Well, it might, no. it's gonna spin to here. Yeah. yeah, it is. It's gonna spin over there a little bit. It might not go that no. far, though. No, no. Well, I think you throw lots of weight at this and try and get the two to spin behind that one. Yeah. And maybe yeah. that we well, can get okay. second we, shot we over that. Sure shooter, huh? yeah. We wanna make sure our shooter is Well, the thing is, let's get rid of this one. We're still gonna be able to yeah. pound away yeah. with mine. Yeah. So throw peel weight. Okay. okay, there's no point in saying anything. You heard the whole thing from from the skipper.
Here's a good look. They're frozen. And the yellow stone that's uh, sitting on the button is going to come off the red one and spin over slightly in behind the other red rock on the top of the forefoot. The whole key is we're on thirds rock. And at the end of this, Team Canada wants their red stones to be in front of the other stones in a position where they can be pumped up. And you heard Sanders say, then I can start to take Whoa. some run at something. Jan Betker yes. here in the seventh. Yeah, that worked out well. That'll work. Good shot. Shot stone the yellow. <laughs> yeah, shot stone is the we yellow. Got big time mess here. You gotta punch this one back. Red nice is, shot, Jan. Yeah, red is okay. second. Yeah. Hank, you better give me like down control or we won't be able to. Okay. I don't know. Yeah. Saskatchewan can hit the yeah, red go. stone in the hey. forefoot and roll over a little bit. Game's moving quite slowly. Saskatchewan time clock ticking down more quickly than the Team Canada one. Whoa. Uh, five minutes difference Whoa. between the two clocks. Whoa. 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 Saskatchewan Whoa. playing no. much, no. Oh. Whoa. 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 much slower. Yes. They've had Whoa. The yes. tougher no. shots Whoa. too, haven't they? Whoa. Whoa. No, no, no. More than half? Okay, that's all right. That's all right. Right over, Karen. That's good. Nice shot. Actually, they can't get rid of that two rock with that one sitting there. They're, it's not going anywhere, right? They can't get rid of it. I think we should play this one. Okay. We don't want to roll too far over here, though. Okay. They can't get rid of it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Actually, a little. No. Nope. Right. They yeah, can't get rid of get. this stone right well, here. We have to freeze. As long if as this here, one here, sits here. Yeah. That's fine. Okay. Nothing they, they can do with that. that. You heard Sandra okay. say. Nose isn't bad. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. Let me hit the back one. Whoops. Unless you want to play the double on that. No. No? No, because they can't get rid of that too. Just a little flip in. They can't get rid of that two stone frozen. It's jamming, so there's no point in, no point in removing that one that it's jamming on. So you want to just get a little flip. Hitting the stone at the back of the forefoot, the yellow stone that uh, Jan Becker has her brush beside. Trying to roll in behind. I want to keep my shooter in the ring. So back of the button. Yeah. No. Sandra no, 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 no. Easy way, She Jen. leads four to one. Well, well close. Well, curl. Curl. No, no. Well, 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 crash well, on her own. We're going to get by. Well, Finishes well, just well, in time. Well, I'm wondering if I, if I, uh, just tap it if I back. just hit T line weight, right? Tap it back. Yeah. Okay. And I just pop this, so this goes here. Yeah. And my, and then I'm gonna sit there. Okay. Is that how we're gonna get two? Yeah. Who else has the four foot to draw? Because like right now, the only thing I have is to draw here, right? Just hit and if this I don't make it back. around, she hits and she hits and rolls. Mm -hmm. Right now, she pops that, Move and that I'm, back I've there. got two, right? Mm -hmm. Do you think? Yeah, I think it's uh T-line way. Just pop this okay. so that so that yeah. this is going here and we I'm trying to open that one up. Hey. Okay, yeah, no, Do I you agree. like that? Yeah, for sure. You know, the other thing is to just draw in here. That's a really hard draw though. But it's a tough draw. I stay here and she just hits and rolls yeah, exactly. and then we're yeah. <laughs> If you're wondering what the applause are for, it's for this. Alberta against Yukon Northwest Territories. Final stone for Kelly Kalo out of the Yukon, trailing 2-1.
And watch the angle raise to pick this stone off the four foot to count two. And the team from Yellowknife moves in front now, 3 2 over Alberta. And Kathy Borst. I like this column, don't you? Yeah, I, I really like the fact that they're rearranging those stones, whether you tap your own and split a little bit or tap the red onto it. Somehow you have to rearrange that setup so the Team Canada stone isn't in such a great Wait, position. Yes. Kowski, Daku. Hurry, hurry, come on. Hurry ahead, hurry ahead. Hurry ahead, come on, we gotta move it. Great shot. To get some movement and some separation. The cross the ring double is there now. Oh, get. Well, I just wanna roll into here. Yeah, 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 okay. If I play the double, that's great, right? We want to roll past that one, though. Yeah. We want to roll for sure over there. Yeah. No, no, hit that and roll. Yeah. Got the double, too, if we want. Okay. Just can't nose hit it, right? Well, even if we... Yeah, I don't want to. Okay, let's do it. There's a hit and roll, and there's probably a double. Yeah. Double's a lot. Yeah. Okay, you heard, heard her say very clearly, I want to hit this one here. No, too much can go wrong. Roll over one. here, like so. But I want to roll it past the line of that one, so I don't set up a double. And she said, if I happen to get the double, that would be great. I want to roll in. That's why uh, Saskatchewan, we're hoping the rocks would actually spread out a little more, so they wouldn't have things so congested, and there wouldn't be two stones blocking a possible Team Canada rock. Put her right. Cusper haven't put a brush to it. Hit it too thin. Jammed on her own. And now what's available? Can you tap it back? Raise to get so three. I'm just going to give you like. Um, no, the problem weight. is where the shooter will yeah, be I, over the redstone yep, in the eight swap. foot. Yeah. Um, I agree, Linda. I, I think when you hit this one, just have, you have to get it's some. It's fine. Any of that front one with hack? You'd have to get the roll on this one here. Hit that onto there and remove that. That's for sure. But where's the yeah, shooter going to be? Weight. Right about here. And we're not. We so can't this is get. Come into play. If we have, we'd, no. This is a shot no, for I don't two. Think I can go in for yep. Well, the crowd and their emotions have been split. Both teams from the Cali Club in Regina. Big shot, though, Linda. Two points is big here. It is. It's huge. Now, the only problem is they've used a lot of time this end. There's been a lot of thinking involved here. Yes! Right away, out of her hand. Anywhere on the outside, you got your yes! deuce. No! Anywhere on the outside. Yes! You'll stay with the brushing. Hooray! For two. Come on. And out the back, they've got it. So Kathy Trowell and the team for the Cali. Saskatchewan take advantage of the miss hit by Schmirler to pick up two. And now they're within one. She says she forgives you. But next time, she's calling Allied. Okay. Okay. Thank you. The Redstones leading 6-3. It's Tammy Lowther from Charlottetown, New Brunswick, skipped by Kathy Floyd from the Thistle St. Andrews in St. John. So Yellowstone is shot and covered. And how do you get in there for two? Well, that's the question. Is there a port or do you play the little tap on the Yellowstone top? Just biting, actually. Looks to me like they're looking at the hole between the yellow guard and the red guard, but it looks pretty tiny. Kathy Floyd in her eighth appearance at a national championship. Both these teams coming in with records of one and one. This is the fifth draw.
That's a tough one. For Kathy to get this, they have to come through the port and still avoid the redstone. That's, you can see them talking about June Campbell's uh, kind of pointing at where the rock will go, even if he makes it, even if the stone makes it through the hole. Tighten it up, June. We're talking the center line hole. Is that the one? I'm assuming so. Stone in the eighth for New Brunswick and Floyd looking to pick up two here. Close the gap to one. Won't make it. If the hole was as much as a, a rock with. Yeah, it was very tiny. One for New Brunswick. <laughs> 6-4 PEI leading after eight and Prince Edward Island to have the hammer play nine. Getting late now in this fifth draw here at the Agrodome. Let's update you on all the scores. British Columbia leading Quebec. PEI, we just updated for you. You saw that wonderful shot by Kelly Kahlo. Alberta has the hammer back now as Kathy Borst looks to win her third in a row. And that's our featured game as we go to the eighth. Team Canada, Sandra Schmerler with the hammer. After Kathy Trowell scored two and seven. Four three, Team Canada lead. It's so been an interesting start to the end. There was a run back attempt that jammed. There was a couple of nice takeouts by Saskatchewan and then a lovely roll here by Joan. No line. How's line? To sit buried Rachel top four. Great roll. No Karen line. Daku. Just hang it up here. Okay, no, 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 no. Short's Starting fine. Big. Just playing to the okay, face yeah. of it or anywhere no, in front no. of that stone. Sorry, yeah, too great to it. Whoa, 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 no bounce, no bounce, no, no bounce. Okay. No, sir. Very That's nice. Good That's a good shot, you're right. Sorry, don't right here. That is a good shot. Good job, Sandra having a long this look at this. She's stone. still got yeah. quite a bit of time on the clock, but Saskatchewan will have to really be thinking in advance for every shot. Yeah, they really what? worked that clock down. What to do here? What to do? This is a yeah. okay. wonderful yeah, shot. It opens it up at least, eh? Yeah, I like the yeah. feel. Talking about taking okay. the guard off. What forces this is the terrific shot made on the face yep. of the stone in the forefoot. Joe McCusker. Well, 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 well. It's good. Shot. Shot, Joe. Two very nice shots by Joan. The hit and roll, and now the peel. Christy Lewis. you by Ford which province has won the most Canadian championships Manitoba I, I was gonna say Saskatchewan yeah, I, thought, I would have said Saskatchewan. In, in the heart you mean yeah Saskatchewan with 10 you had to clarify the question Canadian championships well yeah you but uh, this, is, this is obviously more than this is in the history of Canadian women's championship curling. Women's. We had to have women's in there. That's just, right. You well, said Canadian championships. Yeah. Well, you Ray was men's. adding men's and yeah. juniors. And, you know. so that's a good way to get out of that one. Otherwise, I think I was right on with that. 
<laughs> Saskatchewan has a very He's proud wrong. history in women's play. Vera Pezzer, Joyce McKee, some of the great yeah. teams. Chrissy's come back strong after a little bit of a shaky start. She's sure made some has. good shots, yeah. Well, that's good. That's good. That's good right there. Shot. That's good. That's good. That's okay. On the that's nose. Good. Throw a bit of up weight, okay? Okay. Just save your shooter in the rings. Doubles there. Jan Victor. Oh, oh, oh. Great brushing again to hold it up for her. All right, Marcia Gooderight, Joan McCusker. Nice shots, Jan. Been some terrific shots the last couple of ends. Nice spill off of the two Saskatchewan rocks. Take one, we'll get hammered, get really team. has been a game of everything. We've yeah, had blank ends and game. then lots of rocks in play and some very interesting angles last end, which took quite a while to think out. The jam to lie to. Sorry, it's good. Look, the camera's ready to pound this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kathy's looked really yeah. relaxed to me, sure both was, before so. the game when I chatted with her and throughout mm -hmm. the game when some of the other players had difficulties. Most notably, of course, Christy had a couple of problems one end. She's just been so cool and she's been the calming influence, and it's not easy for the skip to do that. You're already having to think so much, and there's the pressure of making the, the last two shots, but she's been terrific. Yeah, I sure like what I see too. She, she looks like a good one. Just normal. It's really hard to, be, to stand out in this province when you have someone like Sandra winning everything in sight, you know. imperative that you stick here and force Sandra to take the single. You heard her say, let's force her to take one. And we can go for our deuce in nine and take our chances in 10. Okay, we got two timeouts. Seven minutes and in. Considering the sixth end where there was all those Team Canada rocks in the house and Kathy had to make a fantastic shot to cut them down. Now this has turned into a very Wait interesting yet. game. Yep. Final stone for Saskatchewan here in this eighth. Hurry, 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 Go hard. Now that's a big miss. Right out. Huge. Yeah, that is a big miss. I just really babied it. Yeah. Just under two. I just really babied it. Yeah. Just never got quite out there. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, sorry. Shit. That's a huge miss. Hit for two. Team Canada can score two here. He knows that, that we're okay. We take it, we're fine. We'll try and get two. Remember in the <laughs> when was fourth, this? she had the chance to get three, had to settle for two. I think two. because of the frost, I just don't think it's going to come up. If it does, we get the nose. Yeah, exactly.
it spin far enough it will so another missed opportunity and is that a brushing mistake or she missed it uh, I don't know it's a missed opportunity it what is that? It is here in Regina Welcome back to TSN Tonight, everyone. I'm Gino Retta. Back to Regina for ninth end action with Canada Lean Saskatchewan 5-3 in a moment. Right now, let's go to the hardwood. It's the Grizzlies and the... Tell you what, missed opportunity. Saskatchewan and, and yep, Trowell yep, yep, yep. can feel very fortunate that they're that close, Linda. Yeah. Boy, the frost has really snuck into the rings, uh, especially into the darker the darker colored uh, red circle and blue circle. Yeah. You see how fast that, st uh, that stone stopped? I mean, it looked like it was going to slide right through the rings. Now you have to be very aware at this time of day. That on that spot. Late yeah. evening, the building is getting warmer. Well, the leads uh, try and get the stones into good position, and they've played pretty well, but everybody Whoa. has to be aware Whoa. of that frost, Whoa. whether or not they're in a path that will slide or whether they're in a path that will not slide. Not that top one. Should be okay. 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 Saskatchewan has the corner up, yep. and if the... The team can can find that weight, and the skip can find the place to put the room to get it there. They've got the come around possibility. Good chance here in the corner. E even short's good here, Linda. You know, you just you just don't want to overthrow this. Sweepers are very aware. You can hear them say it's going to dig. We have to be ready to sweep it. Yeah, finish it. Come on. Keep it clean. Keep it clean. Come on. Right back. Right back. Right back. Right back. Nice Beautiful. shot. By Karen Daku. Karen's played well. Get the top one fine. This kind of weight. That is, that is nice great shot. curling. Nice Updating Yukon Northwest Territories in Alberta as they play the ninth. They showed you the terrific shot by so Kelly Kalo. Now this is the final stone by Kathy Borst, who's won her first two great games, trying to remain undefeated. And she's got to come through a port. Linda, draw full eight foot for a single. I really liked uh, Kelly's play. She put the rock top 12 foot, forcing Kathy to come through the hole with draw weight. For the single to tie. Nice shot. But with the ice conditions changing and Kathy Borsa just missed a draw, I think it was a good try. Yeah, me too. So the team from Yellowknife will have the hammer coming home in a 3 3 tie. A big miss and a chance for now yes. uh, Team Canada to take the guard off. Yeah, you just, even short was a good shot. You just couldn't throw it through. Joan's not going to miss many of those. No. Or Jan, rather, going to miss many of those. She's had a terrific game. We, you mentioned that earlier, Ray, that uh, at third, Jan has just been so solid, which we expect from her. There are two stones in the house, so there is still something for Saskatchewan to work with. They're going to try and come down to the stone back of the 12 foot. We've got lots, Kath. Should be okay. No. We need Might a good freeze here. here. No By Christy Lewis. No line at all. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. What Sandra doesn't want to do is hit this on the nose and stick there. She wants to nearly the good pocket. And there's an example of those numbers that we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, good. Okay. Yep, move. No. Yes. Yep. Yeah, 
He wants to roll away from there. You don't want to sit and leave a pocket. Here are all the scores now. Late. Tenth end updates for you. Oh, yes, Klaus! Yes, for line! T line? Yes, for line! Saskatchewan okay, third, line. Christy Lewis. And her line, final stone here in nine. You got no backing. Weight was fine, just good, but nose hit. Picking up the ice is, is really a key, and we mentioned that, that in the reading ice segment. When the that. ice starts to change like this, as Linda's mentioned, the frost has come into the rings, and uh, it's a real art to, to read ice and to understand that. It's and, on the nose. And uh, Sandra has had so much experience at that. That's one of the things also that separates her from a lot of other teams. I grab that back one. She's been, oh up, God, always seems to be able to adjust to the to the elements and to the changes in the, in, in well, the ice surfaces through the game. So where some other curlers yeah. don't. And that's experience, of course. Now, in fairness to Kathy Trowell, her numbers may be a little lower. Came into the game at 77 percent. She's had some very tough shots. Trouble at the back right and lie four. Is that enough ice? Yep. Okay. Right to that back one. Okay. Yeah. It's like four, hey? Yeah. yeah, we have to watch the sweep. It's just fudging a bit, but. Throw the normal weight. As long it's our sweeping. We'll get okay. it there. I think that's the right ice. I think if I get out there any further, it's not going to. No, this is good. Wait only. Kathy wait, Trowell good. with her good. first Saskatchewan. Whoa, whoa, no line, no yeah. line. Wait, with wait, the wait. hammer. No line. No, we got to leave no, it. No, 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 no. Sorry, yeah, She had yeah. the way and she knew it was going to die when it got into the dark paint in particular. Just let him go. Just, just, take it. just kidding. Just keep just taking it back. Just let him go. Well, she said too much just ice. Just Actually, I could play the out turn too, so couldn't yeah, I? It's been uh, the case on a few of their yeah, freeze attempts and come on attempts. You can throw whatever you want, yeah. Maybe play the out turn, yeah. Nose isn't bad or it flops, great. Yeah. Just a little flop. Yeah. Sounds good. It'll come over that much. Yeah. Just the same weight I just just threw that. Nice control. Threatened the entire no, game. No, no, Team no. Canada and Sandra Schmirler. No, no. Looking no. to win their third in a row. Okay. Now they lie five. I'm so close. That's the right roll, just too hard. That was great weight. Needs a forefoot with this one. Waves close. No backing. No backing? No backing. Kathy Trowell. Well, 
And now realizing that it digs no, in no, here and the, no, no, the dark no. paint, as you say, no. she's going to need something to let it dig in. Slide too far, gives up one, gives up two, gives up three, and maybe more. One, two, three for sure, possibly four. I said four, yeah. That's fine. Oh, yeah. And that's it. Team that's Canada fine, will remain undefeated. Good luck, Good luck. They win it. Nine to three, the final. At two and zero, Kathy Borst in a battle here with the Yukon Northwest Territories and Kelly Kalo. It's tied 3-3, and the team from Yellowknife has the hammer. Well, it was an interesting game. It, it, you know, uh, Christy uh, Lewis uh, struggled a little bit in the, in the beginning of that game, and that kind of and and you heard at the very end. Uh, Sandra Schmurter turned to, to Jan Becker and said, boy, Jan, are you hot? And is she ever? She just missed absolutely nothing, Victor. And, and, when, and when you, and that's, I mean, I'm sure our viewers get tired of us repeating this, but it, it, this team just has this great knack. And I guess all teams that are, are champions like this have that, that ability to be able to pounce at the right time, you know, finish you off. It's like, it's like the boxer that, uh, you know, you know, gets the big hit and then knows how to finish you off and put you down. Well, without a doubt, that's in fact, what they do. In fact, Saskatchewan really, and Kathy Trowell, they were, if you take that boxing analogy, were staggered a few times. Mm -hmm. Canada missed a chance for three in the fourth, yep. settled for two. My goodness, Saskatchewan, she, if Trowell doesn't make a great shot against five, she gives up a steal of one, the game's over there. Yeah, exactly. So uh, this Saskatchewan team was wobbling and they just finally went down in nine with the steal of three. And then the Talon nine. Yes, you bet. Threw it in. Well, we've worked that to death. Yeah. <laughs> Kathy Borst trying to remain undefeated. Go to three and zero as Schmirler has done here in the fifth draw. I think she's playing the intern come around or it could be the tap back as well. I'm not sure. We haven't you know, we're not sure of the ice here. The, but the way uh, Heather's moved up. She's playing the raise. Trying to tap it back. And we'll tap it to the back of the eight foot. Shot rock. And a reminder, of course, she'll be able to chat with the red hot Ooh. Jan Betker. Was she ever? Online, www.tsn.ca slash curling is the TSN web address. Record crowd, 7,300 plus, applauding the departure of their Saskatchewan champions, Kathy Trowell. I'm sure they were torn in their emotions and who to cheer for. Both those teams from the Cali right here in the jump. Well, this young lady's made some great shots in this game, and Kelly Kalo. Turn hit, you can see it all. To make the hit and sit back 12. And now Borst has one more. Trying to find a place to hide, and the applause for Sandra Schmirler and her team. Once By the end of this, could be alone on top of the standings. Perfect. Once again, it's really, uh, it's really neat to be in this building tonight because you're, you're among so many people that know curling so well, and, and uh, they're applauding some great shots. Uh, young <laughs> Skip from Quebec just made a tremendous freeze in her game, and, and uh, there's three games going, and they're all run down to last rock, so. 
We'll try and get everywhere for you. Playing the, the Rays again, I think, uh, Vic, Kathy Borst. All right, let's just keep an eye on that game, Quebec, British Columbia. You mentioned about the great freeze. This is the final stone for Sue Garvey. You see she's trailing out of Kamloops, makes the hit, and where does it go? Is she moving enough? It is 6-6. Six, six. She gets her single, and they'll go to an extra end, BC and Quebec. Now, let's go back to Kathy Borst and her final stone in a 3-3 tie without Last Rock. Heather Godperson calling the line again on a raise. Well, it just didn't curl for uh, Kathy, so it's a... Uh, Kelly Kalo has a hit here, and she doesn't have to stay. Just gets it out of the rings, and she wins this game. Be a big win for the team from the Yukon Northwest Territories. You'll get a chance to see her tomorrow morning as Victor and I will bring you the Yukon Northwest Territories and Manitoba game early in the morning at uh, 10 a.m. Eastern Time. We continue with our three draws a day on the Scott Tournament of Hearts. The young Quebec skip made that great freeze, otherwise she loses that game, Vic. I mean, they were lying three when she went down to throw and she froze to the face, and all, all the BC could do was do it the, exactly what they did, was hit it for one, and now they're in an extra end. So there's been some tremendous shot making and certainly being appreciated by a huge crowd, 7,300, a record-setting crowd. Now they hit for no, Kelly Kalo no. to win her game. So far, it looks pretty good coming down here. There it is, doesn't hold. The shooter scores her two, and the team from the Yukon is on the board. They win it. 5-3, the final over Alberta to win their first in hand, Kathy Borst. Her first loss of this, Scott. So Alberta is two and one. Kalo from Yellowknife one and two, and on to a game tomorrow morning against Manitoba. Now PEI, New Brunswick. You see PEI leading six five. This is the final stone, hammer stone by Tammy Lauder of Charlottetown, but it is New Brunswick lying one. This angle raised now to get rid of the stone, and now who is shot? And enough, it is the red stone. She'll add one more, and it'll be a 7-5 win for PEI over Kathy Floyd from the Thistle St. Andrews in St. John. So PEI is now 2-1. and one. New Brunswick, 1-2. and two. Three games are final. One more goes to an extra end. BC and Quebec will wrap that up when we come back. Hi, Lindsay. <laughs> Hi, Lindsay. The Nabob Coffee Company has harnessed the power of the volcano. You see, the nutrients in this volcanic ash enrich the nearby coffee fields and help grow the better beans for Nabob tradition. I'm here to select only those better beans that meet our high standards and give Nabob tradition coffee its better flavor and aroma. Mm. At Nabob, we get better beans. You get better coffee. Some of us thrive in wet situations. Scott towels are no exception. Thirsty Scott towels are so absorbent and strong, you can trust them to soak up quickly, which is a good thing. For most of us. Scott towels, always thirsty for more. You don't choose to have an accident, but you can choose your repair center. More than one million Canadians have relied on AutoPro, the largest network of automotive professionals. AutoPro Collision, a courteous reception. Professional repairs. Qualified technicians. 
specialized equipment. And in addition to AutoPro's national warranty, take advantage of our deductible protection plan, AutoPro Collision. People you can trust. Since the Hendrick Racing Team started using Quaker State, they finished 1-2 in the 96 Winston Cup standings. Finished 1-2-3 this year at Daytona. And they've won at Rockingham, Bristol, Martinsville, and Charlotte. Which makes you wonder, is it in their blood or in their engines? Quaker State. The quality the Hendrick Racing Team demands. The quality your car deserves. Introducing eight hours of fever relief. New Children's Advil. <laughs> A tough cold isn't just up here. Your sinuses are congested too. That's why there's Advil cold and sinus for congestion. It's tough on colds like Advil is on pain. And now it's available without a prescription. Advil cold and sinus. Today's relief for tough colds. After five draws, they are the only undefeated team. The defending Canadian World Champions Olympic gold medal winners, Sandra Schmirler wins 8-3 over Kathy Trowell and Saskatchewan. Nobody had a better game than third Jan Betker and Jan's with Linda. Well, Jan, when I came down, I said you're sizzling. You just had a terrific game. I don't know what else to say about it. Well, thank you. Um... Yeah, I had nowhere to go from but up after my first game. I, I wasn't playing very good, so today was a good day for me to pull up my socks a bit. But you had to think that the first day, the ice was a little tricky and you're a little tired coming off the Olympics. I'm sure you thought that it was going to pick up. Well, I'd hoped. I hoped I wasn't <laughs> going to play like that the whole week. But, yeah, the ice is a little bit, a uh, little tricky. Uh, the frost is kind of creeping in there about fifth end break. It starts to creep in, and, and it's a little bit straighter than what we had in practice even. So uh, it was just a matter of getting used to that, I think. Terrific crowd, terrific evening playing Saskatchewan. How did it feel out there? Oh, it's fun. It's great when you can play in front of a packed house. And, uh, you know, there's lots of cheers out there for both sides, so it was, it's great. It's not just one, one team that's getting all, all the cheers, so that's great to play. We really enjoyed it. A very interesting game. Now, I understand you're going online. You get to get some of the tough questions that Ray and I normally get. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun, I'm sure. Well, I hope so. So everybody there, uh, give me a call or whatever you do. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure they'll get online and chat with you. Thank you very much. Okay. Great game. We look forward to the rest of the week. Thanks, Linda. Vic? Well, what you do is you've got to be online. And here's the web address, www.tsn.ca slash curling to chat with Jan Betker for about the next 15 to 20 minutes. An online chat with Jan Betker from here at the Scott Tournament of Hearts in Regina. So there's one game remaining in this fifth draw. It's Quebec against British Columbia in a 6-6 tie. BC getting one in 10. So Quebec and this very young team from the Riverbend Alma Curling Club in Alma, Quebec, has the hammer in this extra end. Quebec playing Yellow Stones. Yeah. This Quebec team beat Chantel Osborne, former Saskatchewan champ, former Saskatchewan, sorry, former Quebec champion in their provincial playdowns to advance. Who a nose hit, you don't want that. They had the, the house, uh, the front of the house pretty clean for a while. They've had a couple of nose hits now. So this gives BC a chance to play the intern, come around, get to the top of that four foot. They're taking about the middle of the, more than the middle of the eight foot. Play the come around, try and get this rock buried. BC third is Jan Wilson. Coming off a loss hurry, go hard, this hurry, afternoon, 9-5 to Manitoba. Quebec also losing this afternoon to Alberta, 6-5.
It was interesting chatting with Jan and talking about the ice. She felt the second half of the game, it started to straighten up again. And we can expect that, I guess, every evening. And they're fighting the frost, fighting the heat in this building. It is so warm in here. Jan's rock was a little exposed. As I mentioned, it isn't curling as much. Uh, they couldn't quite get at it. Jan and her husband, three-time BC Mixed Champions. Gee, you don't want this deep. You're looking for the guard. Not too bad after making the wonderful come around chance to cap it with the guard and set up the double. Quebec third is Natalie Gagnon. To get them both. Nice shot. C'est bon, c'est bon. draw here Linda I would well, we haven't seen this ice and we don't know the conditions as they change but just, just, uh, we saw one walk right over there a moment ago the intern come around looks like she could play the hit the hit and roll she is <laughs> what Linda and I were talking about is you could whoa what happened to that who is that guy you could play the come around. We saw the intern come around into this area here. But what she's decided to do is to play this hit on this one here and try and roll over there into this area there. I have to keep an eye on this one because if the circles are getting a little warm and the house is less lively, they'll have to be careful where they hit it to get that roll. It's a couple of feet she wants to get mm -hmm. over there. Sue Garvey in this BC Championship team from the Kamloops Curling Club. Yeah. Yes. Whoa. Yep. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Hurry. 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 Roll it a little bit farther. No. Nope. The comments were were interesting. I mean, that's exactly what happened. They could have brushed that all away because the houses are so dead when they make contact. There's that frost in there that Jan talked about that we talked about in the last game. It's funny, it's changed though, uh, Ray. This morning, eh, Linda, on that first draw, which, when you know you said the ice was a little keener, certainly more lively than mm -hmm. ours. Is where yeah, I mean, well, it's changed over the course of the day. I, I think overall the ice was, was was great today. It got trickier as Jan mm -hmm. once again mentioned. Uh, after N5, you could see it's changing a little bit. That's also the, uh, you know, when it's so important to have that experience that we talked about, uh, Sandra having reading that ice and uh, understanding it. Adjusting to the chain in it. Such a big part of this game, all those elements. The 24 year old skip of this Quebec championship team, Marie Claude Carlos. If she sits right there, it's going to be tough for BC. Ooh, that's a great shot. She's really cool. I mean, she laid, uh, you were down at the ice level. And did you see the freeze she made in that tent? I did. Unbelievable. She just froze right to the, they were lying three against her. She came down, she froze it right on the face. And all uh, Sue Garvey could do was what she had, what she did was to get the one, was to hit it on the nose. You have to give all the skips credit, actually. Tammy Lowther of PEI made a wonderful shot mm -hmm. to win 7-5 over New Brunswick. And <laughs> Kelly Kilo from the territories, it seemed end after end, made terrific shots to defeat Alberta. So. Uh, Really some great curling. Yeah, we had some terrific games across the ice. Yeah. Nice when there's a full house. You know. Yeah, Jen said uh, 
I mean, even they who've played many, many times in an arena haven't really experienced something like tonight. So full, so exciting. The people greeted, of course, the two Saskatchewan teams in a terrific ovation to start the game. So it's a very nice experience for them tonight. I'm looking for the little flip, as I mentioned, that shot by Quebec made it very tough for BC. Stone's wide open. And she doesn't take much time. Just put the broom down and scoots down the ice. The hit for the win in an extra end here in this fifth draw of the Scott Tournament of Hearts. Both these teams with records of one and one coming in. Marie Claude Carlos. Well, pretty cool, wasn't she? Just fires Look at that this. Rock and right on the nose. And for the win, 7 6, the final. Quebec beats BC. So Quebec now 2 and 1. British Columbia. Sue Garvey from Kamloops 1 and 2. The fifth draw is complete. Quick break. We'll recap things. China, Saskatchewan on TSN is brought to you by Scotty's Facial Tissue, the perfect combination of softness and strength. Our featured game was all Saskatchewan. Team Canada against the provincial champions. And Schmerler wins it 8-3 to, to remain undefeated through five draws. Now it's time for the TSN Turning Point, brought to you by Super 8 Motels. Well, Victor, we're going to walk you right back to the fourth end of this game. Actually, in this particular end, Sandra has a chance for three. But it's the placement of her shot, her first shot on this end, that sets the rocks in absolutely a perfect spot that makes it very difficult for the Saskatchewan team to make a shot. And it turns out, as I mentioned, Sandra has a draw for three in this end and only gets two, but this two points took control, and that was the difference in the game. She never relinquished it. She goes on to win 8-3 for her third straight. A cash donation will be made to the Coaching Association of Canada for the training and development of coaches in amateur sport on behalf of TSN and Super 8 Motels with over 1,600 locations throughout North America. Life's great at Super 8.